Ladies. Gentlemen. <coughs> welcome, welcome, welcome. To the fourth attempt of Path of Radiance Maniac Mode. It is time! It is time! This time! I will beat it! I will beat it! I will not fail! I will play well. We will defeat Ashnard. I will succeed! Focus mode, thunder energy, meteor energy, all the energies I need from you guys to get through this. This will be the run. This will be the run. This will be the run, ladies and gentlemen. This will be the run. We will not die at Ashnard. We will be playing Maniac Mode. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care how well I have to play. How are you guys doing? Hello, Hanako. Hello, Patrick. Hello, The Last Rebel. Hello, Harry. Hello, Arthur. Hello, Free For All. Hello, El Spuria. Hello, OK Dude. Hello, Monl. Hello, Silverhouse. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, Sev. Hello, Big Tasty. Hello, The Last Rebel. Hello, Donlot. Nice attempt, Donlot. I was a little relieved to see you not. I was cheering for you, but at the same time, I was hoping you wouldn't be able to do it. Uh, now, I have been proven wrong. There has, in fact, people have recorded themselves beating Maniac Mode and Iron Man before. It's usually like very small channels and Japanese channels and whatnot. I, I still want to claim the Meng's World first. I still think that's a good title to claim, even though I know it has been done before. So, we are going to be playing on Maniac Mode. And uh, a lot of people have been like, oh, make sure you fix. Fixed growth is boring, okay? I don't. I want the RNG goddess to bless units. Fixed is boring. That means I get the same units every time. Bleh. No, we want random. Because random gives you the ability to get really blessed units, which is so much more fun. Fixed is bleh. Who wants to play the same game as everyone else? And uh, I want to show you something really, really cool. Let me know if the music is too loud. Obviously, I am speeding up the, uh... I'm speeding up the, the music, so I'm, spe I'm speeding up the game, so I'm turning off music, obviously. Uh, but I have something really cool to show you guys, which I think you'll really, really like. So, um... Alright, is the music okay? You like the music? It's not too loud, it's not too low. Um, so we're obviously speeding it up because otherwise uh, otherwise the game just becomes unplayable. Uh, so we're gonna turn off the health window, we're going to... I like to reduce the grid thickness just a little bit, fast, fast game speed. I hate my wife, why would you say such a thing? Alright, you guys wanna see something insanely cool? You guys want to see something insanely cool that I that I managed to do with this game? Lower the music just a tad bit. Is it better now? 5% lower? Alright. Look at the screen, ladies and gentlemen. Look at the screen. That's right. It's a little it's a little janky. It's a little janky. It's a little janky. It it will like pop up during cutscenes sometimes and stuff like that. But we actually have a battle forecast. It doesn't show damage. It doesn't show it doesn't show damage, but it shows hit rates and crit rates. So what this is, this is a plugin that's developed by uh, oh god, I forgot his name already. Um, I'll, I'll throw a link to his Twitch in the video. What was he called? Uh, Sunken Dolphin or something? I, I don't remember. Um, uh, sorry, I really should know your name. You helped me out. Uh, I'll throw a link in the video description. I think someone may 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 know. Um, 
So, uh, basically, he made a plugin that reads the game's memory. Taint? What do you mean, taint? It's not taint. Hey, for gory. I'm sorry, I'm awful at this. Wait, let me... It's not taint. Jellyfish Swimmer! Jellyfish Swimmer, that's his name. Sorry about that, I forgot his Twitch name. So, his name is Jellyfish Fish Swimmer, and he made this amazing plugin that actually shows hit rate and crit rates. Uh, so, we gotta drink some bone rari, that's very important. How is it taint? How is this should be displayed to you? This is, it's absolutely stupid that it's not, that it's not displayed to you in game. Minx made it so every unit has... It's not taint, it's just showing you information. It literally just allows you to see how how the hit rate of the enemies are uh, on enemy face, which is not something Path of Radiance tells you, which is very which, which is very frustrating. To people saying it's saying you guys are just stupid. I'm sorry, you're wrong. Yeah, you're trolling. They're trolling. Uh, I know. So uh, I really like this. Uh, sometimes it will bug out. Like sometimes if if Ike equips the Regal Sword out of all things. It will actually glitch a little bit for some reason. I'm not entirely sure why, but most of the time it's it's it works really well. Oh yeah, they'll still show up even with animations off. Yeah, they'll show up even without animation. So I'll show you in the next one. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Here we go. This one, this level up is going to. Okay, all right, I'm okay with that. Yeah, I'm okay with that. That's fine with me. Yeah, I, I, I'm 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 completely okay with that. I uh, I think I think like speed. I'd like strength, but speed is completely fine too. I find that Ike's first level up is very often like it it sets the precedence for the entire run. You know. Uh, let me just uh, check something really quick. Uh, there we go. So we're gonna go on to chapter one. Oh yeah, we're not doing fixed. We're not doing fixed growth rates. Absolutely not. Seraphrobe to Ike. Uh, I like to give the Seraphrobe to Ike. I don't necessarily think it's like the best thing to do, but you definitely can do that. Yeah. I don't think it's like the best thing to do, but but I, th I think it I think it works. Um. <clears throat> let's do let's do this one. I like this I, li I like this track. All right, let me read some donations real quick. Uh, Noel donated two bucks to Super Chat. Good luck, Mangs. Send all the energy our way. Pyros donated five bucks. Late energy tainted with latent power. It's already a good run. That's great. Agent Nightmare, donated 10 bucks to Super Shot. Looking forward to the inevitable Elincia's demise. No! Now, do I still have my, uh... Mm -mm 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 -mm. Wait a minute. Remember to like the... Do the Mia Blast. There's some Mia Blasts. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Am I getting rings? Oh, cool. Yeah, so I'm getting the bands because I've technically beat the game. You can call me! You can take as much as you want, chat. You can say take as much as you want. I'm keeping them. Alright, so I'm just going to briefly talk about how useful I think the Eunice will be on, on Maniac mode. Ike is pretty much essential. You have to use him and you need to get a good Ike because you need him against Ashnark. So I'm going to try my best to uh, use him to the best of his ability. Hopefully we'll get a good Ike. Uh, Oscar is one of the more important units on Maniac Mode, if you can keep him alive. It's very important, so I'll see about that. Uh, supporting him up with Ike is pretty good in the early game. Getting getting him a support with Kieran is pretty nice. Uh, Boyd is a unit who, if you want to use him, I think you have to support him with Oscar. Otherwise, he's just not very good. Obviously, I have to use him, but... Um, 
he's usually not a very good unit in Maniac mode. Titania is gonna be, it's, she's the best unit in the game. I don't think it's even close. She's viable way into the late game, thanks to her growth rates, but she will actually start to struggle a little bit on Clash on some of the late game maps because you kind of need capped stats to deal with those maps. So we'll see about that. Also, Ike does not get his four iron swords on Maniac mode, so suck it. Kind of sucks, but that's just how it goes. Boyd and... Okay, uh, wait. Who... Boyd and Oscar don't support? Oh, okay. I thought they did. I guess they don't. I guess they don't. So, uh... I don't remember if it's okay to attack here or if I should use Oscar first. It's been a while since I played this map. So, yeah, you can, you can see the, um... You can see the enemy and player hit rates pop up whenever they're, be they're attacking there. Oh, nice. Some, like, enemies will have somewhat random stats sometimes. Change the camera angle? What do you mean? You don't like to have it like this? Just solo the game with Mystia? I guess that'll work. Alright, so I like to send Titania over here to deal with the Myrmidon. But not too many of the Myrmidons. I mean, like, we don't want Titania to kill too many units, do we? I've often wanted to hack the game to see what that village contains. I don't think you can visit it. I would be very surprised if you did. Are you using bans? Yes, I am using bans. No matter how much you yell taint, I will keep using bans. So it's so nice to see what the enemies actually have in terms of hit rate. The Myrmidons are very are very accurate, as you can see right here. It crashes the game if you hack it to visit it. Ah, yeah, makes sense. Now, sometimes this emulator will crash. I'm sorry about that. Um, sometimes it'll start to glitch out a little bit. I have updated to the latest one. It doesn't help. Category ban percent. You guys are the worst. Have I ever told you guys? You, you, you guys are the worst sometimes. So I don't want to give too many kills to Titania here, so I'm going to back off a little bit. Oh, look at that. We got a crash already. Luckily, I make a, I make save states at the start of every turn, because the Dolphin emulator just is a little bit weird sometimes. You made us like this? Oh, so it's my fault now. Ah. Oh. Ah, I see. It's my fault. So, if I do this, uh, how much damage does this guy do? He does 14, this guy does 14, so Ike will die here if I'm not careful, so... I guess I'll just go... I guess I'll have to use my Vulnerary Race. Kinda sucks, I don't want to, but I, I don't think I have a choice. So I want to make sure that Oscar and Ike gets the most... Sees the most combat here, 7 damage, maybe I'll just not attack. Or maybe I'll just go like this. I think I'll just go like this. Ike will take some damage here, but that's fine. 92% chance to hit. Okay, we get another Ike level up very soon. Manx, if you speed up the emulator, sometimes you can cry. I, I am well aware. I am well aware, which is why I'm, I'm saving at the start of every turn. I'm not loading it for Iron Man purpose. Oh, nice crit. Oscar had 13 crit. Oh, it's because he's next to Boyd. That's why. Ah, he gets the 10% bond support from Boyd. That's why. Why are you going for Titania? Titania stealing experience, as always. How many resets so far? None? Do you have any faith in me at all? Alright, let's see. Let's see what I get. Okay, well, he got his strength. He got his strength, guys. <laughs> I, got where I, I got what I wished for, ladies and gentlemen. He got his strength. Alright. Time to send Oscar back a little bit. We also probably want to visit this village with Void. I don't remember what you get here. Is it a steel sword? Yeah, you get a steel sword in this uh, village right here. Uh, so let's see. So we get... We take 8 damage from this guy. And then we get 8 damage from this guy. So we will probably die if we're not careful. So we need to be... Oh shit, where's my vulnerary? What the hell? Seraphrobe to Ike. I know it's the basic bitch option, but I, I feel like it's also the most 
I feel like it's it's the most Iron Man viable. Don't you guys think so? Run over already. Play without speed up? I would rather cut off my leg. Use on Mia. You guys think Mia will see any play? I'm not a Don Lot. I don't simp for Mia. Sorry to say, but I don't. I do not simp. We do not simp for Mia in this house. I'm sorry to say, but we we do not. Okay, so uh, we'll kill this guy. There's a small chance that I can die here, so I'll, I'll have to quaff on. You do have to quaff some vulnerabilities in the early game, which is a little bit annoying, but it's, it's not the end of the world. Also, I gotta remember to turn on bonus uh, display. There we go. Uh, sound output, stereo, message sounds, unit facing. Oh, that's interesting. Auto and auto cursors. Okay, help window off. All right, I think we got all the settings nailed down now. Mia is one of the worst units in the game, and not only is she... Oh my god, I thought he doubled there. Yeah, the battle forecast doesn't tell you if you double or not. Oh, that's a crit. 3% crit, ladies and gentlemen. 2% crit. Oh, poor Ike. Careful, careful now. It's kind of dangerous to do this. Ah, uh, yeah, this is... This is very scary. I think we need to do more vulneraries. I'm using up all my vulneraries here. But I'll get risk next chapter, so it's not... Actually, uh, will I? Yeah, next chapter's the one where I get risk, right? Oh shit, wait, no! No, 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 no! Oh shit, please get defense. Oh no. No, 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 I can't lose Oscar and... I can't... No! 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 No, 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 no! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! Oh no! Oh no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh my god. <laughs> I never lost Oscar in chapter one before. Oh, that's funny. Uh, should I just keep going? Should I, should I just keep going? Or should I reset? Okay, let me let me let me ask chat whether or not you guys think this is worth a reset or not. <laughs> or if I I'll, I'll let chat decide whether or not we should uh, whether or not we should. Okay. That is that is legitimately hilarious. I think I I went a little too hard trying to train Oscar and Ike in the first chapter. It's it's not using Oscar in the early game is probably a little. Oh my goodness, reset. Okay, seventy percent says reset. So we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna. Oops. All right. Okay. Yeah, I was I, I got greedy. I got greedy. I tried to train only Ike and Oscar in the first chapter. Just use Titania to kill a couple of the units. It's, it's um. Okay, so that was just the warm up. Now begins the true attempt, guys. Now begins the true attempt, ladies and gentlemen. Now begins. Now begins the true attempt, guys. That was that was just like a little we just had to get used to it, you know? We just had to kind of get used to it. But now we're really back. Now we're really back. You got to check biorhythm. Yeah, you got to remember to check biorhythm, guys. Very very important to check the biorhythm. Spring donated 5 bucks for super shot. Hi egg, your chat's bugged. Oh wait, wrong script. Ahem, uh rig. Remember to turn on bonus experience display. Good idea. Uh, there we go. So how many vulnera- Does it matter how many vulneraries you drink in this fight? I think Ike's- I think Ike's inventory is reset, right? Okay, we're not- we're not resetting anymore, guys. We're not- Okay, I think- Does it matter how many you use? You- you can get away with just using one? Okay, alright. 
It isn't reset. Alright, okay, then we'll definitely try to save them. Alright, okay, let's let's see if Ike gets a better level up this time. Noel, don't know two bucks. Good luck, man. Send all the energy your way. Okay! Alright! Okay! That's pretty good! That's pretty good. Check by... No. I, n I will never... I will never check by rhythm. That is one of the things I promised you guys right now. Oh, it does carry over, right. I will never check by rhythm. Never. Ever. 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 Alright, we need, we need more hype music, guys. Checking by rhythm is for noobs, okay? What is by rhythm again? Okay, this time around, I will kill one guy with Titania. Haven't played in a bit. What is it? No, I will not check by rhythm. Shut up. Shut up. No by rhythm. Absolutely no by rhythm. Do we dare to gamble on this one? We do. There you go. Suboptimal? You're suboptimal. Alright, we got the steel sword. That's good. Buy rhythm is for losers, okay? No no player worth their salt ever checks buy rhythm. It's, it's a lie. It's, it's, it's propaganda. That's what it is. Egg is bullying chat. Chat is bullying me. Every time. I wonder if Ike avoided that thanks to Biorhythm. Oh, he probably did. Okay, chat, since you're so fucking up concerned with Biorhythm, tell me in a very simple sentence, how do you fix Biorhythm? How do you fix it? Like, 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 tell me. How do you... How does Biorhythm go from a good mechanic to a bad mechanic? Remove it, 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 remove it. Oh, look at that. Remove it, remove it, remove it, remove it. Maybe I went a little too hard on Titania this chapter. Honestly, Oscar is the one who should be fighting this guy. Hit No! No HP level ups? No, 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 no. We can't have that, Ike. No, 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 no. Don't start leveling up like that. Don't start leveling up like that on me now, Ike. That's terrible. Alpha King of Wessex, don't have five bucks. Hey, Egg, you lose this time. You have to try a Rev Iron Man again. That should make you win. You don't command me, Alfred. I don't have to do a goddamn re No! Ah, uh, oh wait, I have a steel sword. I have a steel sword. I have a steel sword. Maybe I should give the fighter ban to Ike, honestly. Yeah, why why the hell don't I put the fighter ban on Ike? Oh, he gets doubled. Okay, good. That's good. Uh a little bit worried about Oscar. I'm, I'm gonna put Titania right here. Ow. That hurt. Why does the Axe Fighter have a steel sword? Because he just visited a village that gave it. Idiot. Um, okay, what if we let we let Oscar chip this guy just a little bit? Hopefully. Yeah, so now he's get he gets the time. Oscar has a Boyd support with Oid. Oid? A Boyd a Boyd support with Oid. Yeah! <laughs> He has a point support with Boyd. <laughs> he has a bond support with Boyd. A Boyd, a bo Boyd support with Boyd. <laughs> he has a bond support with Boyd. And that gives him 10% crit whenever they're adjacent. However, I would like to say that this doesn't always... This is not always good. Um, because the problem is that this very often makes him crit enemies and take multiple hits on the enemy and on enemy face, which is not good. 
Okay, I have to use the Vulnerary on Ike now, sadly. It's a bit sad. I really don't want to do it, but I have no choice. So, yeah. I'm gonna put Ike up here. Now, I don't... If I remember correctly, I don't think Titania one runs the boss. Or maybe she does. As she does, sadly, one round him, so... I would like to feed him to Ike as well, I think. Or maybe to Oscar. I could just give it to Titania, too. It's just easier. Ow. Probably better to just let Titania do it, don't you guys think? I'll, I'll let Boyd chip in a little bit here to save myself a vulnerary use. She doesn't double if she rescues someone. That's a good point. Hmm. Yeah, I can rescue I can rescue Ike with her or Boyd. Come the f Ike! What is this? Ike! Please don't do this to me. I'm getting a bad Ike, you guys. I'm getting a bad Ike. Okay, alright. Uh, not sure if this is enough, though. Probably not. What if, what if Ike gets the Angelic Robe this turn? Does that heal him as well? No, it doesn't. Oh wait, he heals? Hmm. 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 Now this is taint. Now this. This is taint. Now this is pod painting right here. This. This. This, I am happy to say, is a Lotainta. Yeah, don't worry, I'm not gonna level Titania to level 20 this way. I know a certain madman who probably would do that, but I, I no. I, I like my streams to be fun, thank you very much. Alright, let's kill him with Ike. Bonk. Last Rebel, donor of five bucks. Egg, you never use Mia, so how can you say she's bad? And she's still better than Soth, in my opinion. Okay, so she's better than the worst unit in the game. I don't know if that really proves your point, Rebel. I mean... Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't... I still got I still got bonus experience, even, even after doing that. That's kind of funny. That's kind of funny. ba da ba ba Alright, so this time, we don't get Titania for like the first four turns. So it's pretty much just hunker down and try to survive to the best of our abilities. Which is not easy. But it's what we have to do. Did I not end the... Did I not end the poll yet? I guess I didn't. I did not end the poll. Oh, we got a thousand people watching. Hi there, guys. Uh... All right, we are on chapter two, ladies and gentlemen. This one is always a tricky one because you, as I said, you don't have Titania, and you're kind of stuck. So what you got to do is you got to create sort of like a like a formation. You got to create. Uh, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna keep Riss here. So this is Riss. Uh, he is kind of necessary because he's your only healer for a very long while. But I do think he falls off. I know, I know. Sometimes he can survive, especially if you give him shade. But I find that he just he gets one shot in the late game. It's really problematic. Um, his yeah. Oh wow, half spiral effects, just wonderful. Um, it does have to pre spam though, which is nice. Uh, maybe he should get the angelic robe. No, I already gave it to Ike. Sorry about that. So I think we're just gonna do this. Uh, we'll, we'll put you here. That way he can heal all of them. And it's literally just like, I mean, we could take a pot shot. One, two, three, four, five. Nah, I think I'm just gonna stay here. You don't need to check Byra the Monris. That's very true. That's very true, chat. I didn't think about that, but you're right.
He checked by rhythm, liar. <laughs> Mang's exposed. That defensive formation is very risky. I mean, it does mean Ike faces a lot of combat, which may not be great. I think we we want to make sure we get rid of the Myrmidon, because he's kind of hard to kill. Ironically, like, the Myrmidons are some of the hardest to kill enemies here. Ooh, we have to... If we do this, we have to trade that sword away from Ike. Ike being attacked from tree side sucks. I, mean, I, guess, I guess I could always put Void here. It is... It is... Maybe a possibility, and then we can use Riss to heal up Ike. You got an ad? Oh yeah, uh, I'm sorry guys. Uh, so, uh, this is kind of new with YouTube. And I I'm really sorry to say this, but... They're starting to roll this change out in November. I can no longer control where my ads go. So, I I'm sorry guys. This is just a YouTube thing now. I'm sorry, guys. I, I don't know what to say. I wish it wasn't like that. I really do. All I can say is, like, I guess you could use an ad blocker or something or get YouTube Premium. But I'm sorry, guys. I hate it. I hate it, too. I hate it, too. YouTube is just getting more and more greedy. And I just got informed that I will no, like, I, very soon, I will no longer even be allowed to decide where my mid-roll ad, ads go. Which I think is terrible practice, if I'm gonna be completely honest. Um, I really don't like it. But there's also nothing I can really do about it, so. Anyway, Ike is getting pummeled here. But we do have Titania back, which is good. We definitely want to use her to kill, like, a couple of enemies, like the Myrmidons and whatnot. I do want Boyd to be attacked less now, though, so... Do you have a patron? Yeah, I do. I do. Um, I don't really use it for that much. Sometimes I a lot... So I, I, like, let a couple people get into the CMU, and I, that's pretty much about it. I, I gave up trying to figure out what to do with patron a long time ago. This is just, uh... I'm just one guy. I think patron works better for, like, multi... Like, YouTube channels run by multiple people. So, I just use my Patreon as a kind of like, a, hey, you can get into my custom thing. Uh, but I don't expect anyone to support me on there. Rip Ike? What? Why are you saying Rip Ike? Well, I'm a guy, so I can't just put feed pics on my Patreon and get you guys to sub, you know? Oh boy. Oh boy. Boy, that's one crit. Getting emotes on live chat is fun. Yeah, you like that emote, don't you, uh, on the mood? Bro, did you even try? Did you even try? I'm not posting feed pics on my Patreon, guys. I'm getting- I'm engaged, you guys. I can't do shit like that. You can't or you won't. I've shown my feet live on stream before. I'll have you know, and people made a bunch of memes out of it. You want feed. There's a booba emote. Honestly, I haven't updated my emotes in a while. I think I actually have multiple. I have multiple new emote slots. So if you guys like, what kind of emotes would you like to see? Like, is there something that we need? Like fire energy, maybe? Um. Sham emote, foot emote. Shaw emote, Baudemon emote. I could do a Baudemon emote, that's fine with me. I'm okay with that. Alright, we gotta we gotta try and kill some of these guys. I really don't like these Myrmidons, so I'm gonna try and actually you know, I'm probably going to replace Boyd's position here with Titania. Katana Mang Simone. Uh, no, what the hell? Oh, that was a top. That kind of scared me a little bit. Is I gonna be okay? Ooh, I don't know if Ike's gonna be okay here, you guys. Uh, how much does Riss heal? Okay, he heals twenty. That's actually pretty good. I, th I think, I think I, Ike will be okay here. Yeah, I think so. Like, how hard does these guys hit Oscar? Oscar should be fine now, I think. Alright, oh, they have Vulnerary's on them. It's too bad. You know what I would have really liked in Path of Radiance? 
I would have liked a uh, early game thief would have been pretty cool. So you could run around and steal vulnerabilities and stuff. I think if I made like a Redux patch of Path of Radiance, maybe I would have made like Soul Joint from the start or something. I don't know, that does require like rewriting a story a little bit, but I think that would have been kind of cool if, if Soul was part of the Grail Mercenaries. He'd be a hell of a lot better than he is in the game now at least. All right, here we go. We got speed on Oscar. Uh, speed on Oscar is good, but it's... I really wish it was more than that, though. I really wish it was more than that, though. Are these guys just... Yeah, these guys are just hanging around. I'm gonna be very careful with Riss here, so he doesn't get picked off. It's very, it's very easy to get him picked off. So, it's nice to see these hit rates, like... I have around a 50% chance to hit Ike, that's fine. Hit points, strength, skill, defense, resistance. Alright, so we got two crappy level ups with Ikes thus far. And then we got some actually kind of halfway decent ones. So, actually not too terrible here. It's a better level for sure. So, uh, for the second wave of enemies right here, I do like to cope up in the, uh, in the healing bush. I got all right levels. Oscar has not gotten strength and speed yet, which is a little bit sad. I kind of kind of wish that he got that. So what's how do I target the next unit? Uh, let's see. How do I target the next unit? Uh, F, no? Ah, there we go. That's how I do that. Cope up. We always got to cope up, guys. Every single time, we always got to cope up. Cope up! Surround them all! Don't let a single- Now you do actually have to be a little bit cautious with Riss's heal staff. Just a tiny little bit cautious because it is a little while until you get a new one. I think you get it in the escape chapter. Manx, are you using a GameCube? Nah, my man, I'm using, I'm using a good old-fashioned dolphin emulator. The most Sundere of emulators. But I've gotten to a point, I think, where Oscar starts to double somewhat frequently, which is actually pretty nice. Uh, Dolphin's- yeah, Dolphin is a very Sundere emulator. It's- it's a nightmare to work with, honestly. I really hate it. Now what? Ah, uh, it's okay, Boyd. I'm not using you anyway. Ah, uh, it's okay. That's funny. Uh, I didn't even realize he was damaged. That's that's really funny. It's okay. No one cares about Boyd. It's he, he's not an important unit to this run, you guys. That's <laughs> wait. Oh, shit, I forgot about this guy. Holy shit. Um. Oh, I'm not killing him with Titania. That's actually pretty cool. Rip Iron Axe. Ah. Who cares about it? You get a lot of Iron Axes in this game. It's fine. It's not a problem. It's okay. Like, no one cares. No one cares about Boyd. He's, he's not important, you guys. Like, you don't need him to be successful. No, I gave the fighter band to Ike. You see? It's so... It, we didn't even lose that. We didn't even lose the fighter band, you guys. We just gotta create sort of like a perfect formation right here. How will you get the Boyd support with Oid? With, <laughs> with Oid? I don't know, guys. I don't think we're getting the Oid support. I'm sorry to say, but the Oid support is gone. Stop rushing. I'm playing super safe. What are you talking about? I'm literally playing as safe as I possibly can play. Like, I'm mega safe. Do you see how safe I'm playing this? I got Ike and a heal hedge and everything. I'm not rushing. Look, I'm playing this super slowly. What are you talking about? Look, he's running away for a, uh, for a vulnerary right now. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull the enemy now. So I'm gonna put Titania right here. Yeah, so enemies will trade around Bone Rares in this game, which is kind of annoying. 
Oh shit, that's a kill. Billy Erasmo donated four ninety nine to super chat. Thank you. Noel donated two bucks. A late emote. Yeah, we need a late emote actually. Oh shit, she kills this guy too. Uh oh. Uh uh oh. Yeah, that's not great. Uh, we definitely don't want to give them the bush, though, so... I think we'll put uh, Oscar here, and then we'll put Riss right here. And we'll put Titania right here. Alright, this'll be fine, guys. This'll be fine. Look. Look, he has the bush, so he just... Well, he actually still kind of gets hit. Uh, but this is this is good experience for Oscar, so I'm okay with this. It's a, it's hilarious when they steal the boss's elixir. That is kind of funny, I'm not gonna lie. That is kind of funny. Oh, that's the, that's the fucking boss. Okay, how are we doing here? Well, this is great experience for Oscar. And Ike gets healed by the heal hatch. So if we just, like, continue to stand here, I do believe we'll be fine. Did Path of Radiance copy from Aldaran Saga? Yeah, yeah, they totally did. Oh, no. This is a bad omen. We don't want this song to play. Okay, we just don't want attack. We need to not attack. That's what we need to do here. So they have about a 70% chance to hit Oscar, which is fine. I think we're okay. The Myrmidon's gonna enter the fray right now. The boss hits only a little bit harder, but it's also worth a lot of experience. So I think this is fine. Oh. What the? No. No. Oh, okay. Thank goodness. I don't know what happened there. I need to make more safe states. There we go. And we'll just not attack. That's my strategy right here, is to not attack. Uh, sorry, sometimes the emulator will crash and there's very little I can do about it. Speed! Okay, so Oscar just got a second speed level up. Oscar just got a second speed level up. Uh, but he's not leveling strength, which is actually a problem. Uh... I gets healed too by the heal hedge. Okay. I have to heal Oscar every turn, I'm pretty sure. If I don't... Like, if both of the bosses hit him. I'm also worried about him, like, killing the boss. This guy just runs away. Okay. You could just not speed up. Yeah, I could also finish this Iron Man run not in 2027. Um... Yeah, you guys want to watch me play Clash with animations on at 100% speed? Sounds sounds amazing, doesn't it? Uh, okay, I think we'll attack here. And then we'll heal with Riss, and we'll leave Ike where he is. This is how you train Oscar and Ike, guys. Bro, Boyd already? Come on. He's not important! Oh, we got strength on Riss. This is great. We got, <laughs> we got strength on Riss, guys. This is beautiful. Wait, what's the boss doing? Is he running to a heal hedge? Bruh. Wait, what? Bruh. Bruh? Bruh? Is the boss gonna run back in taints? Oh my god, he is! The boss is tainting! Oh no. The boss is gonna taint. Uh, I don't know how viable this is. We'll, we're gonna we're gonna break our weapons, I think. Like Oscar's gonna break his lance at some point if we're not careful here. But we're gonna break our heal staff too. So I don't know if this is like viable long term. We probably wanna we probably wanna chill a little bit. All right, it's another it's another. Uh... Oh, let's go! Let's go! That's what I'm talking about. That's an Ike level up right there. That's an Ike level up right there. That's what it's all about. Andrew Norris, donor to 10 bucks. Hey, Mangs, absolutely love this game and watching your content. Super happy I caught the start of the stream. Good luck and keep up the good work. Thank you. Thank you. I'll, I'll, I'll try my best. We'll see how it goes. Wow, my Ike is crazy right now. That's the boss. That's great. All right, we got... Oh, we got the speed wing, so... This speed wing is, is like, this speed wing can make or break units. So, um, there's a lot of things you can do with it. You could give it to Oscar to ensure he doubles. You can give it to Soren, which I am inclined to do. Uh, get Titania, are you shitting me? No. Ike, I don't think needs it, honestly. Uh, I really don't think he needs it, guys. 
Oh, if you guys are gonna taint, I'm gonna taint. I'm just gonna stay here in my bush. I'm gonna stay here in my bush. They're not gonna come towards me, are they? I think we'll let Oscar kill them, don't we? Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll let Oscar deal with them. I'm not gonna wait for them all to heal up. Oscar might like it. I am inclined to give it to Oscar, yes. I think I think Oscar is a good candidate. I also think Soren is a good candidate. Um, oh, they're just gonna stand there. Okay, cool. Iliana Brom. I don't want to save it all the way for Brom, man. Okay, you got strength, luck, and defense and resistance. I'm I'm heavily contemplating Oscar here. I think Oscar might be a good idea. Give it to Boyd and throw it on his corpse. Might have saved him, yeah. Use Tormod on Ileana. I intend to use Ileana. Yeah, I don't know about Tormod, but I intend to use Ileana. Alright. Woo. Oh, I think you get like a bonus scene here if someone dies. Let me see. Let me see. <laughs> I got admonished by mommy. No. Mommy's yelling at me. <laughs> uh, I like that they include death scenes for the party. That's actually really, really cool. And one of the things I really appreciate about the... Uh, one thing I really appreciate about this game. Luis Angel Gomez Garcia donated 20 Mexican dollars to Shipshot. Hi, everyone. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. We've only lost Boyd. Uh, I don't think Boyd is normally fieldable in this chapter anyway. So it should be fine. Let's play some side battle. Yeah, so you, yeah, so this is where we we need to be careful about pulling Marsha. This is something I wasn't avail this this is something I wasn't really aware of. Uh, right away. Like, I didn't realize... Ooh, we could give it to Gatry, though. So, Gatry is actually a unit I'm going to use. I'm actually going... I'm actually going to use him. Uh, because Armor Knights are amazing on, uh, in... On Path of Radiance Maniac mode. So, uh... I'm, I'm gonna use Gatry, I'm gonna use Braum. Because Gatry is one of the few units... Uh, we're not doing meme review just yet, guys. Just wait a little bit. Um... So... Wait, maybe we put Speed Wings on Gatry? Maybe? Is that the play? Uh, we also get Shinon, who fucking sucks. There's no way to make this guy viable. Take his archer band off him. Give him, give, give it to someone else. Like Titania, for example. I don't know if she makes any good use of it. But it's better, better left on her than Shinon. That's for sure. Um, let's take a look at the enemies on this map. Like, does the Speedwing actually matter here? I wouldn't say it does, no. But I think it's when you cross this line you pull Marsha, so we gotta be a little bit careful about that. Hmm. I'm very puzzled about the speed wing. Andrew Norris donated 10 bucks. Hey, Manx. Oh, I read that one already. Uh, Norin Guy donated two chefs. Mordium mode. Oh, okay. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Maragi donated 10 bucks. Show us that bald head. There you go. Aside from that, I'd say my, my skin is very clean. Alright. Let's go. Hey guys, I'm on break at work, work right now. Hi there, sweetie. Um, My skin is clean. Yeah, it's very clean. Yeah. It's one of the things I got. I got very good skin. So, I don't remember. Is it here or here? <laughs> Do you guys remember? Do you guys remember which one it is? I, I don't. Um, I actually do not remember, but I do know one thing. Row seven. You can go up to the stall. Stay in line with the barrels. Okay, okay. I'll try that. Man, look at my Ike. Look at my Ike. 
Incredible Ike right now. I got a very good... Wait, what? What is... Oh, shit! He broke his sword. I'm so dumb. I'm so stupid. I got a very good Ike right now. That's actually really cool. Oh, shit. There's an archer. <gasps> okay, I think we're good. I think I can take three attacks. He's really bulky. Doesn't quite double Myrmidons yet, but... Oh, this guy goes for Gatry. Okay, that's fine. Really? You missed a 70? Come on, Gatry. 60? Wow, this guy's hit rates are bad. What the hell? Remember Archer Ike? I remember. Uh, so I can go up here and kill the Archer, right? That's that's viable, right? As long as I, like, can't throw away. And then we'll use... Oh, wait, I can't... Oh, right, you can't do that in this game. I remember now. Ha, huh, you think we could spam clone emote? You know, sweetie, I was just talking about new emotes. I'm glad you weren't here for that. Because we're dead. Maybe, maybe. Actually, you know what? Maybe we could do a Bethany clown emote. And we'll call it Clissony. <laughs> Clissony. That's what we're gonna call it. Okay, I've decided now. We're gonna do a Bethany clown emote in the channel. To punish you. Skill speed luck? Let's go. 11 speed on Ike. Wow. Not bad. Ow. Not bad at all. Har, har, har. Now you'll be the clown. All right, we do want to soften these guys up a little bit with Shinon. Uh, we can actually use the steel buff for this, which is nice. Ba -ba -da 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 -da. Oh shit, this guy actually doesn't kill. What the hell? Uh, but we do need that vulnerary. Let's get it up and running. I think I'll just kill with Titania then, in that case. And then I'll put Gatri right here. Oh shit, this guy's got a hand axe? Oh, I guess he does. So there's no, like, set turn that Marsha spawns on, right? I don't think so, at least. Pretty sure there's, like, no set turn that Marsha spawns on. My Ike is crazy right now. What the hell? Look at this. Oh my goodness, this is crazy. Turn 15? She spawns on turn... Are you serious? She spawns on turn 15, like, regardless? I don't believe that. I've never heard about this before. Dolphin's glitching a little bit. Yeah, if it gets much worse, I'll do a restart. Uh, I think, in fact, I'll do a restart right now. There we go. Uh, let me see. Sometimes it can help to restart the emulator. I know I'm loading a save. Oh, oh dang Oh my god, I got a this thing thing, guys. Let's see. Hmm. Dang I was timed out? Good. I hope you get timed out again. Uh, let's see. <laughs> I'm the least toxic streamer. Sweetie, look what you did. Look what you did. Now everyone's spamming clown emojis. Twice, twice the dishwashing duty for you when you come to Norway in December. My kitchen's gonna be so dirty. Maybe the glitches occur because you're playing at extra speed. It, honestly, it varies depending on the map I find. I think this map in particular is very prone to glitching. Because so, there's a lot of it going on right now. I. It could also be that zooming in uh, causes more glitching or zooming out. And it actually looks like that is the case. We can play a little bit zoomed in if you guys want. 
So I, I think it's depending on the layout of the map, honestly. And the emulator and its general, like, how it's feeling today. This is why I keep calling Dolphin very tsundere. Because Dolphin is like a woman. Like, it's just like the mood just swings. I mean, you never quite know why it does the way, why it does the way, like, why it acts the way it acts. You just don't know. Anyway, let's go get the elixir. Alright, we got the elixir from Nasir. That's good. I hope to get Nasir later on. And, uh... Now we want to go and get Marsha. You need Marsha for the pre... So Marsha's a unit that I don't think I'll be using. I just don't think her stats are good enough on main hack mode. But I want to have her. Now, I'm probably not stealthing again, you guys. I'm sorry to say. I know a lot of you got... Okay, so now I get to see their hit rates on Marsha, which is kind of nice. 60% chance to hit, actually. That's higher than I thought. Anyway, let's go get Marsha. Of course, you don't get her in this chapter. She just flies away. So... Yeah, you just... You get her, but, like, you get her later on, though. Wasn't Dolphin a Sundare for crashing when you do something? Yeah, Dolphin doesn't like it when you do other things. It's like, what? Baka? You're focusing on other things than me? B -b -b Baka? I'm gonna crash now? It's not like I want you to play me or anything. So yeah, Dolphin gets very jealous when you do other applications. It, like, crashes immediately. It just wants you to focus on it right away. It's a very demanding emulator. It's annoying. Very high-maintenance woman. Do you eat tacos on Friday, Manx? I just ordered, like, uh, low-carb tortillas. They're gonna get her in two days, so I'm having tacos. Hope it might get her tomorrow. If it does, I'm gonna be very happy. So, I'm having tacos tomorrow, if that's the case. Alright, let's go a little bit slow here. I'm actually training Gatry a little bit, which is not something I usually do, but I think it's gonna pay off now. I want him to get a couple of levels. Alright, here we go. 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 Oh! Did we just give Gatry the speed wings right now? No point in low carb if you're chugging soft drinks. Okay, listen here, fucking idiot. You see what? You see this little thing here? Pepsi Max? Can you fucking read? Read, idiot. You see that? You see that? You see what it says on it? Yeah. It's no sugar or carbs, you idiot. God, you sound like my fiance. Not, I mean, sorry, sweet, sweetie. Not, you're an idiot, obviously. You're very brilliant and whatnot. Um. Mm, did you know Pepsi Max is sugar? No, it doesn't. That's the point. It doesn't have sugar. Let me go. I'm a, I'm a 16 year old guy who lives in my mom's basement. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you dietary advice. That's how. You, <laughs> that's how you sound. <laughs> oh. I'm so triggered right now. Oh, that's the boss. Hi, Havetti. Spring donut at two bucks for super shot. Clown emoji? Question mark, question mark. You tell me, buddy. You tell me. You're the one spamming it. Let him live his life. Okay, we got another Ike level up here. Oh my goodness, I am getting the Ike of the century. I am getting the Ike of the century. I am getting the Ike of the century. This is amazing. Is this kill boss or route? I can never remember. I can never remember. Uh... Oh, hi there. Kill boss. Okay, so we don't want to kill Havati right away. Or ideally, we'd like him to retreat a little bit. Okay. We... Oh! I got hit all... Oh, Gatry, please be careful. Please be careful, Gatry. That was actually kind of terrifying. I don't know. It's literally... Oh, yeah, it says defeat boss right there. Yeah, you're right. Whew. Okay, uh, I'm gonna use my hand axe to kill this guy. Ooh, actually, look at that. That's actually not enough, but it, it might make him retreat, though. 18 health? It should be okay. Even if he attacks Ike, he has like a 28% chance to hit him, so should be fine. 
Did you know that the objective is always displayed on screen? Well, I know now. Thanks for reminding me. I just forgot for a little moment there. Oh, Titan actually has 57 hit rates on the Myrmidon. I didn't realize they were so low. Wow. All right, I think we'll just let... Uh, can we let Gatry get this kill, maybe? We can, in theory. Nice! Read Kayla's dono. In a moment, in a moment. Oh, we get the Thief Band! Ah, we get the Thief Band! We get the Thief... I think we'll do meme review next chapter, guys. Next chapter. Oh, yeah, so the Regal Sword, by the way, that bugs out my plugin. <laughs> it bugs out the plugin something fierce, if I remember correctly. We'll see, we'll see if it still happens. Um... Don't worry, I'll go read some donations now. I'll go read some donations. Hello, mood. Don't let twenty Donkey Kong's true super chat. Everyone is toxic today. Keep it coming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Audience is very toxic. It's thanks to thanks to my fiance. Kokoro donated 49 Mexican dollars through Super Chat. Haven't watched you since Three Houses, Mangs. You got this. Ah, nice. Welcome back. It's nice to see some returning people. Kayla donated 9.99 through Super Chat. Clown, clown, clown. Thank you, Kayla. Why are my modes like this? Sev donated two bucks. Randomized Radiant Dawn ever again. That was really cool. I might do it as an Iron Man, honestly. That sounds like it could be interesting. Um, T TX donated five bucks. I'm asking in combat, but I don't fully believe... I asked in comment, but I don't fully believe them. Is Astrid going to be a unit you're using? I'm going to be completely honest, uh, Astrid fanboys. I do not think she's Maniac Mode viable. I'm sorry to say. I don't think she's Maniac Mode viable. Because she's too squishy. Maybe if you give her in a robe. But her her bases are so low. Her HP is so low. Uh, she's going to die in Clash. That's the problem. So I don't know if she's viable. So we'll see. We'll see. All right, ladies and gentlemen. So this chapter without Boyd might be a little challenging, honestly. I'm. I think I'm gonna have to. I think what I did last time was I ran up here. Oh, so uh, this time around we do get uh, Soren, who I think I'm gonna give my speed wings to. If you can like get Soren to snowball, then he's very strong. The thing about Soren though is they kind of cap speed on his own, so it's not necessarily useful. He's like very close to capping it at least. But if we give him like two speed wings, then he will double consistently, which will make him very strong. Um. So, hmm. Curse chest donated two bucks. Did you know that thieves move? I had no idea. I think I'm gonna give him the thief band. Yeah. Oh wait, you don't get Oscar in this chapter? Ah, yeah, you don't. That fucking sucks. Save the speed bings for a while. If you give it to Sorin, though, he's so good with it. But I agree that it can be a waste because he can cap speed on his own. So I think what I'll do is, um, on the first turn, I think we'll create a formate. We'll use Shinon and his provoke. I think we'll 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 move up with Shinon. We'll kill this guy, and then we'll place Sorin here, Gatri here, and Ike here, and we'll create like a. And then we'll 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 like basically cover up in the northern part of the map. Ike should get a speed wing, bruh. Have you seen my Ike? He's crazy good. Let me make sure everyone has their proper equipments. Uh, that steel axe is not needed on, on Oscar. We can trade that over to... I sh actually don't think she needs it. No, she doesn't. This map will be tough without Boyd. Boyd isn't deployable. Shit, that's right. Oh, fuck. Oh, you called me out. Witcher stream for Halloween. Oh, wow. That would be fun, actually. I love The Witcher, man. I love The Witcher 3. It's my... It's... Like, it's... Uh, I think it's, like, tied with Fire Emblem for my favorite game ever. Witcher is, like, my comfort game. Whenever I'm stressed out, I play The Witcher. 
Uh, okay, so I think what we'll do here is we'll move Shinon up like this. Can we kill this guy on the first turn? No. Shinon, like, you can see, enemies are already getting very bulky. Uh, but what we can do is we can send... Ideally, though, I'm wondering if maybe Ike can kill this guy. If I use the Steel Sword... I, I do need to heal him, though, if I'm gonna do that, so... Let's see, if we use 11 times 2... Yeah, then I can get the kill, actually, and that works. And they're gonna go for Shinon because of Provoke. Triss or Yennefer? I'm a Triss guy. I, we, I've, had, I've talked about this plenty of times. I think Triss is the objectively superior girl. Uh, I understand, like, Yennefer is more prevalent in the books, and I agree with that, but in the video games, you'd be an idiot not to pick Triss. Like, I'm sorry, Triss is infinitely better. She's prettier, she's nicer to Geralt. In the book, Triss is a bit of a weirdo. So, if, if you're talking books, then Yennefer, but in video games, my good, how could you not pick Triss? You gotta be, yeah, I gotta have mental illness or something, I don't know. But everyone, but the true waifu is obviously Gwent, that's, that's very true. You always, there's always a chance to play Gwent, guys. Alright, I want to kill this Myrmidon, and uh, I want to see, can this guy go around? Yeah, so, I want to kill this Myrmidon, and then I think I want to run into the bush with Titania. Oh shit, I can't, Oh, Ooh. Okay. Oh wow, that hit rate is way worse than I thought, my goodness. I guess I'll use Gatry. Maybe Soren can get the kill, actually. That would be kind of cool. Wait, can Soren be attacked by these guys? No, he cannot. And okay, let's see how Soren does against the Myrmidon. Six damage. So, with Gatry's Steel Lance, is it enough for a kill? No, it is not. So, we're going to have to use Titania here. Okay, good. Mangus wants the Trissy. That's awful. Trissy, my goodness. I like both of their looks, but personality, it's no context. Trist, Yennefer just treats you like... Uh, she treats you horribly. If you like abuse, then I guess she's your girl. I mean, Yen is very beautiful, don't get me wrong. I see why people like her. She's very beautiful. She's like the goth GF. I get it. But she's terrible to Gerald. She's, um, she's emotionally, uh, like, abusive to him. It's not what she wants. They're always miserable together whenever they're together. Yeah, I know they have a happy ending in the game, but that's just because that's how romance works, you know? Um, okay, I think we'll actually do this. Coming from a Nagatoro fan. Hey, I don't... Look, listen, listen. I don't watch Nagatoro because I want... Oh, shit. Um, oh, no. What am I doing? Uh... Okay, I think we'll put Sora. I need to focus, guys. I'm sorry. I need, I really need to focus. We'll put Soren. Um, okay. Uh, okay. So here's the thing. I think the sniper will actually go for Shinon. I think the sniper will actually go for Shinon over Riss. And even if he doesn't, it's not the end of the world. So we'll put Riss right here. Oh, wait, I can just shove Shinon forward. <laughs> yeah, I can shove him forward. But do I really want to do that? Um, sorry, Archer. Uh, what? what should I do? I mean, I'm pretty sure the Archer will go for Shinon over Riss. Because of Provoke. I think so. And this guy cannot attack that. So we'll do this. And then we'll put Soren in the bush. Because he can't be attacked by anyone else. And he has like a lot of avoid in the bush. So I think that's fine. So we'll do this. Alright. Let's see what happens. Alright, he goes straight for Soren. And he hits. But that's the only unit that can attack Soren though. And Soren actually doubles back, which is kind of cool. And yeah, as you can see right here, they go for Shinon right away. Mangs, I don't like Yennefer because she's emotionally abusive. Also, Mangs, Nagatoro is the greatest anime of all time. Sweetie, fake news. I've never said that Nagatoro is the greatest anime of all time. I said I found it a little charming. I haven't even watched season two yet. I found the anime slightly charming. That's all. 
I'm not a fan, okay? It's not it's not like Vinland Saga for me, okay? My fiance is a spreader of fake news, my goodness. Alright, so um Help? So I think what I'll do is uh, I'll need to tank all of this with um, uh, oh boy, uh, this is a tricky situation I'm in right now. Um, how many javelins do we have? Only like one archer. So I think we need like Ike in this bush, Titania in this bush, and then I think we need like. Ah, uh, fuck me. Ah, uh, uh, Soren. I think we need to. Do we need just move Soren into this bush? Maybe. I think what we need to do is we need to. Yeah, we don't want Soren cannot take too many hits. Um, so I think what we need to do is we need to kill this guy, move Soren, um, kill the archer, I guess, with Shinon? I think Ike doubles the archer. So, let's see, one, two, three, four, five... Six. Is the Sorna five or six? Five move. One, two, three. He can get into this bush. And then does he double the archer? Six speed? No, he doesn't. Uh. Okay, so I think what we do is we, we, we kill this guy. We kill this guy. And then we move... Titania uses a hand axe on the archer, and then... Okay, I, I, see, I see a way out of this, actually. Yeah, I see a way out of this. So we, we do... We start off with Shannon killing this guy. Okay, I, I work this out in my head now. Use Ike to kill this guy from... Oh, shit, he doesn't kill. Uh... Bank on a crit, maybe? Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe... Maybe Soren can actually help out. Um. I thought I worked it out of my head. I thought I worked it out of my head. So we put Gatry here, Titania here, uh, and then oh, shit. So the question is, does Soren get one shot by this guy? I don't think he does. Uh, 20 damage. He doesn't in the bush. He doesn't in the bush. But he needs to be healed. I know Titania can canto. That's not the problem. But can Titania... Kill this guy with a regular... No, she cannot. That's the problem right now. This guy's very bulky. But I guess what Titania can do is she can... Yeah, it's 4 HP. I know, I know she... Yelling Kanto at the screen doesn't fix anything. My goodness. Um, Use the Steel Axe. Maybe the Steel Axe kills? No, it doesn't. Uh, I think, actually, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, if I use, okay, if I canto back, and then I send Soren into the bush to kill this guy, and then I heal Soren, then I think I'm good. Okay, I think I got this now. I don't like that I Titania took damage there, I'm gonna be completely honest. I don't like that at all. Move Titania like that. Move Soren like this. Oh, wait a minute. I can just kill this guy with Ike. 
Yeah. Lol. I can just kill this guy with Ike. Never mind. I don't have to do this. There you go. And then I kill the fighter with Soren. And then I actually don't even need to heal Soren. There we go. And then Soren is actually fine. How do I do global ranges again? I forgot. Uh, I know. I know. There's like a way to do global ranges. I I forgot. Uh, oh, they don't exist. Never mind. I I actually just have to do this. Okay. So yeah, Soren is not in any danger right now. In fact. In fact, how many javelins are there here? Just iron lances and steel. There's one archer. And he does not kill Riss. I actually kind of want to heal Titania here. There's two archers. Oh, shit. Wait, there are? Oh, there are. But one of them is not in... Oh... Oh, shit, they are. You're right. Uh, but if I put Gatry right here, then only one of them can attack. So we'll put Gatry right here. There we go. Rip Shin on. Shin on is fine. What are you talking about? Oh, they're running for the healing edges. That's kind of funny. Shin on is fine. He's very dodgy. Provoke on an archer is kind of funny, actually. Just imagine Shinon, like, yelling, like, yelling curses at his opponent. Alright, let's go. Let's go, Gatry. Whoa. Not bad. You gave bushes to the enemy? I don't care. Wow. Okay. Let's go. Okay, let's go. Okay, a lot of these soldiers are gonna get killed by Titania, but that's fine. Uh, Kayla donated 109. We legit need a Google it emote. Yeah, I agree. I agree. <laughs> that would actually be kind of cool. Thiago Savior donated 10 to Super Chat. Hi, Manx. I love your streams and videos. It always lighten up my day, and I want to reward you for it. I also found someone who did this before you. Spiral Signal on Twitch. Can't... World. Yeah, I know. There, there's several people who have done it, actually. I'm just stupid. I am very aware. I've been made aware that there are several people who have beaten this game on Iron Man mode, but... It's a world first Manx kill, and that's like as as long as I beat Domlot, that's really what matters here, isn't it? Really, guys? I mean, if you really put things into perspective, Domlot is the one I need to beat, right? So, wait, can they actually come through here? Oh fuck, they can! Oh no! Uh, alright. I think maybe it's time for you to go here. Actually, no, I'm gonna do this. Ah! Challenge accepted. Donlot, you're busy with Burvik Saga. Go back and play your weird, weird ass Kaga games. Ah, shit. Uh, where's the other archer? Okay, I think we're safe. I'm pretty sure we're safe right now. Yeah, we're safe. Alfred King of Wessex, no, 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 two bucks. Doing a Halloween stream, maybe Silent Hill 3. Uh, what? When is Halloween? I forgot. Like, when is it? I actually don't remember. Uh, in 11 days. Okay, well, I usually do a Halloween stream, so I guess I have no choice. Well, what do you want to see me play on Halloween? Like, what's a good Halloween game? What do the kids like these days? <laughs> Crying about Kurt's did a fire emblem. Name me your own game saga, but can't play Kagasada. Sad. Wow, a Bundy. A Bundy, no wonder 4chan hates you. My goodness, you really are toxic. Damn. Aw, oh, I'm so sad that's not a kill. Uh, but at the same time, uh, this guy has two health left, so. Uh, 
Now, I didn't really talk much about Soren. Uh, Soren's like an essential unit. I very much like supporting him up with Ike. Uh, because they got a pretty fast support. Soren is like a very essential unit. You can't beat the game without him, but he just makes it so much easier. Uh, Adept is fantastic, but really what he becomes as a sage is just a staff bot. Uh, like, his, he caps magic, which is very nice. He can, like, physic from halfway across the map. And he, he helps Ike survive, which I really appreciate. So, um, I really like, uh, I really like Soren. Let's see, Ike is fine here. Uh, let's give Shinon a heal as well, I guess. Do a Tracia Iron Man on Halloween. Ooh. Do Ike Titania support? Do you have any notion how slow that support is? Do you know how many eons it takes to develop that support? I gotta discard an item? No! I don't like discarding items. Give me the convoy. Hit boy and strength. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! This is the best Ike I've ever had. And it's not even close. Look at this shit! 12 strength and speed at level 10. Most Ikes don't even get this, like... Oh my goodness, this is incredible. Absolutely incredible, my goodness. Absolutely incredible, my goodness. Sorry, I'm very paranoid about losing Riss. Or Reese, as some like to call him. This is the run. Like, this Ike will make everything so much easier. But, I will say, Gatry is actually the one I'm interested in training right now. Uh, so, do I just give this man... Okay, we're, we need to give Soren the Thief Band, I think. Um, I think Soren. I think that's skill and speed, right? So that's actually a really good friend. But yeah, I want. I actually want Gatry to deal with the majority of these enemies. Because uh, it's kind of hard. Like, you gotta. Le I, I need to give him a few levels before he leaves. Yeah, Thief Ban Soren is very nice. I agree. What do the bands actually do? The knife ban is like 5% strength and defense, I think. Which is okay. It's pretty good. Going to work now, good mangs, and good luck. You got this egg. Thank you. I like to think I got this. I hope I got this. We'll see if I actually got this. Uh, this archer's a little bit scary. Uh, but as long as these... I don't think there's any javelins here. Oh, there's a night killer. But he doesn't do shit to Titania, so this is fine. Uh, maybe I can lure a couple of the archers out with Titania, and then I can kill them off with Soren. I think- oh, no, not Ike. Titania. I'll try it. We'll see if it works or not. Gatry going to earn so much trip experience. That's the plan. I'm gonna give him a lot of levels up in this chapter. Okay, you know what? I'm not even mad. Just getting defense on Gat- I want him to cap defense. That's like the most important thing for him to do right now. Like, I'm not even mad. Like, I think that's completely fine with me. Oh, actually, why use Titania to grab archers when I can use Shinon? That's actually way better. What the hell? Yeah, capping defense on Gatry is crazy good. That's what I hope to do. Ah, this is perfect. Oh, shit, he kills them. Oh, boy. That was actually not intended. I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. Is the brown crown still installed? I think so? I haven't taken it away, so I think he's, I still think he has the crown. So I think we'll be okay in that regard. Alright, I want to deal... Okay, all the archers are dead now, I think, which is very good for us. And I can go and finish off this guy. Look at this Ike! Look at him! Crazy good! Absolutely crazy good. I love this Ike. Alright, so we'll, we'll, we'll try to give some kills to Soren if we can. I'm not gonna promise anything. And I need to conserve my heal staff. 
We will see. I wish there was global ranges. It should be so easy to code. Just got it. What happened to Boyd? Uh, we put poison in his bottom. That that is what happened. Vulnerary risk. He's on a heal hedge. He can just eat. He can just eat berries until he feels better. It's fine. As an Ike fan, Boyd, this uh, he is the best Fire Emblem main character. Oh shit! I didn't realize Titania was so low. Holy crap! Did he, did she get hit by a night killer? Is that what happened here? Oh my god. Uh, I think I I think Titania took a night killer to the face. Wow. Holy shit. I've never seen Titania drop this low before. My goodness. Uh, that's actually pretty crazy. This time around, I'm definitely gonna try and conserve my Regal Sword just a tiny bit more. I didn't do that before. Uh, okay, who can attack? Uh, okay, the boss has a Javelin. How hard does he hit? 15. Okay, that's not so bad. Ah, Soren, my man. I wish you had more offense, I really do. But I guess chip damage is better than nothing. Imagine not doubling soldiers. I the soldiers, to be fair, they they can roll anywhere between like three and six speed, so it's uh I do have to be careful though, the boss could kill Riss, so. I do have to keep an eye out for the boss's health. Or the boss's range. The boss is most likely just gonna chug it out javelin at Ike, I think. He might go for Soren? But he can't kill Soren, so I should be okay. Hey, Mangs, plans to train Largo again. Largo is the kind of unit that if you have to train him, then your run is probably fucked. Like, Largo is the... He's the bottom of the barrel. He's the hes the desperation unit. <laughs> I think we can all agree that Largo is the freaking... Like, if, if you ever say to yourself, maybe I can use Largo. Okay, this is fine. Mage, eh? If you ever have to use Largo, that's like when things are really bad. Largo isn't terrible, but if you have to ask yourself that in chapter 27... Really? Oh, so you're gonna be like this now, are you? I see. I see. I see what kind of run this is gonna be. I see what kind of run this is gonna be. I see what kind of run this is going to be. Okay, he keeps going for Soren. You know what? That's fine. I wouldn't mind Soren getting some experience. I actually would not mind that at all. Okay, he does hit Soren pretty hard, so if we want to do this, but giving this boss kill to Soren is not terrible. He's always lost on his books. That's the problem. I have no idea what this track is. I don't recognize this track. Have you ever heard this track in Path of Radiance? I haven't. Have you ever heard this track before? I have not. What a weird... Unused track. Yeah, there are unused tracks in the game data, so that is very... It's a very short track, for sure. That's weird, man. Wow, that is weird, man. That is weird, man. Alright, well, can we get this kill to Soren? Let's try. He got hit, that's okay. I can take another hit, right? Yeah, he can take another hit. There we go. What about this guy? Who can he attack? Oh shit, Ikus might be a little. You know what? Maybe I'll just kill the, uh,. I'll kill the soldier, just to be safe. There you go. Okay, good. Oh, what? 
It's going for Gatry? Why? Okay, he just committed Sudoku. What the f In at one range? At one range? What? Why? Why? This doesn't make any sense. Huh? That is so weird. That is so weird. Oh my goodness. That is that is that is some of the weirdest shit I've ever seen. Why would he do that? Ooh, I like this track. I guess we could do meme review. Manx, you're gonna kill the boss. Uh, what does he drop? A goddess icon? I mean, it's worth it, I think. Alright, let's do meme review, guys. Uh, are we good? I think we're good. The empty spot for Boyd, yeah. The empty spot for Boyd, you guys know it. Alright, let's see if there's any good May Mays, shall we? Oh, there are definitely May Mays here, alright. It's our boy. Alright. Opinion on her? Who the fuck is that? Is that is that sniper wolf? Like I don't I like I I'm just guessing. Who is it? AI? Is it yeah, so I'm not really plugged into the sniper wolf drama. I know she docks someone. I know she's toxic as fuck and uh, and YouTube keeps uh YouTube keeps doxing her. Uh, YouTube keeps doxing. YouTube's I I'm not really like tuned into the drama, but from what I understand, she like is very toxic, and she 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 like doxed another YouTuber, which resulted in like when you're when you like I don't give shit and dox me. I'm not big enough for that to be a threat. But if you dox like a YouTuber with millions of sub, there's a good chance that there are some crazy people in your town that could do your harm. So it is legitimately really really unethical to dox someone like that. Um, as far as what she looks like, I mean she's pretty. I get why people simp over her. Uh, the choker is a big red flag. Sorry, it is. It is. Okay, I, and I can say that because I've dated a lot of red flag girls. Okay, I'm just gonna say. I'm just gonna say. I like chokers, but they're a big red flag. Um, you know, you're looking at 20 years of child support. <laughs> I'm sorry, girls who like to wear chokers, but you know it's true. Um, but... I don't know. Like she seems toxic, but um, I guess YouTube YouTube has a weird tendency. Just just kind of like um, just kind of like how YouTube protects Logan Paul and Jake Paul. Like I feel like there are some people who YouTube just view as too good of an income earners. So like no matter what you try to do to them, YouTube will never like. YouTube is definitely buddy buddy with a few channels. You can really tell. Um, you you can all you can really tell. Uh, and, uh, like, for example, a good example of someone who's not, like, in YouTube's favor is PewDiePie. PewDiePie has, like, earned everything on his own. YouTube hates him. They won't, they won't even put him in the, they wouldn't even put him in the, like, rewinds. So you can always tell, like, who's buddy-buddy with YouTubes and who's, like, on the fringe of YouTube. Sniper Wolf definitely seems like a girl who's, like, buddy-buddy with someone at YouTube. So, like, no matter how many times people report her, uh, she's just never gonna suffer any consequences, and that is just, you know, that's just the world we live in, man. As far as her as a person, I don't know, I don't watch her. I don't watch the drama related to her. She's pretty, I guess, but lots of makeup and angle going on here, so... Might be a little bit overrated in the looks department. Violent of the Coyotes, man, let's go! 
Uh, yeah, I hear she's not a great person, but I, I'm gonna be completely, I'm gonna be completely honest, guys. I don't give a shit. Like, I really don't. Okay, I'm sorry to tell you. People on YouTube often not who they seem to be. That's just how we are. Um, but um, I don't know. I've never watched. I, I've never watched a video of her. I don't think I ever will. Anyway, let me download some. Uh, let me download some more memes. <laughs> uh, you're allowed to not care about something. Thank you, Maka. I appreciate that. I got. I have your approval not to care. Fire Emblem Pit Right revelations that you are egg. Fire Emblem Foot Quest. I hate you. You are banned from posting memes ever again. Never forget Andron Saga. That was taken from a. That is actually Andron Saga's beta menu. That is absolutely true. Yeah. That is that is absolutely true. That's how it used to look. It's pretty funny. Uh, do, 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 do. Yeah, I'm not I'm not clicking random YouTube links. Sorry guys, I'm just not. Da, no, no, no. If you just send me a link to YouTube, then no, no I'm not definitely not doing that. You gotta you gotta write a little bit about the meme and what it's about. Oh, what the fuck? All right, let me get the remaining memes. What the fuck? North Korean news? I subscribed to a North Korean newsletter? That's funny! <laughs> That's funny! Someone subscribed me to a North Korean newsletter. Showing me the activities of Kim Jong-un. That's fucking hilarious. I'm gonna keep this. That is so funny. Hello, fellow... Hello, fellow North Korea enjoyer. It is our pleasure to, <laughs> to bring you news of the great leader's activities. That's fucking amazing. Oh, it's the best troll. I get signed up for a lot of weird shit, but this, this is, this is, I, I'm going to read this later. That's funny. Mang's chat. Mang's bullying chat. Chat bullies me too, okay? I, yeah, this art is so bad. Horrible art. I don't know what they did to my, my girl Rebecca. It's terrible. What is Lelina smoking? She's smoking gotcha orbs, probably. That's funny. She looks high as shit here. I never noticed. You know, this... Okay, Sandra is wearing a bunny outfit. That's kind of funny. But I actually don't think this artwork is bad. It, it's just... It's funny. But it's not badly made. Me when Mang starts a new Path of Radiance Iron Man run. He already reset it in chapter one. Yeah. Yeah, what can I say? We support you, we heal you, we warp you, we thank you. The Pyramid of Path of Radiance. Okay, so Gatry, Titania, and Brahm carries, and then you got Sorin, Ileana, Mist, and Riss, Rayson, Oscar, and Ronolf, and then yeah, this is yeah. Yeah, this is uh this this is pretty accurate. Okay, that's kind of funny. I, I don't know what... Is that... Wait, is that American Psycho? I watched that movie for the first time a little while ago. I'm, pre I'm pretty sure that that's uh, American Psycho, right? Like, he's wearing his little suit? Yeah, it is. That movie is fucking weird. That movie made me question... Like, like that movie made me... It wasn't entertaining. It was just kind of dreadful. It was like, like, watching American Psycho filled me with an existential dread. But, like, it's not like I hated the movie, but it, it like, it's... It does weird things to your brain when you No, not my sexuality. It didn't make me question my sexuality. It, it just... It was, un it was an unpleasant movie to watch. And not just because of the killings, but just because of the... The, 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 the like, the world that the main character is trapped in. It's just so horrendous. Like, it's such a... It's like hell on earth. Awful. Ike, when he realizes he has to tr try to survive maniac mode again. Poor Ike. He's, he's doing pretty good in that regard, though. One bad level up, it's so over. One good level up, we're so back. Is this AI? This is fantastic. This is a great way to use AI. Wait, what? Oh. AI memes can be good. I know there's some AI haters out there, but... 
Pepsi Max says no sugar obtained cancer. Hey, shut up. I haven't gotten it yet. Clown funny. She needs the nose. You gotta put the nose on her. Oh, not this fucking shit again. Oh my goodness. Like seeing a young boy while being surrounded by beautiful women. Delicious, finless, and good fucking food. Yeah, Ike is not very, um... He's surrounded by some pretty girls, and he doesn't seem to care. They don't know that I am old. <laughs> you can still fuck him in birth and conquest, that's fine. Donald Manx, a lot of people say I don't play safe. I play very safe. I'm playing safe right now. Probably one of the safest Fire Emblem players ever. My goodness, I look fat in this image. Holy shit. My own clone. Now neither of us will be very... Don't you... Do don't you... Don't you say that about my girl Tabita. She is nothing like Perry. You take that back right now. What, are folks really happy to just let commanding officers hold on to their money? Why? I have no idea. That's just how things are done, it would seem. Yeah, Fire Emblem kind of weird. You need to rise up and overthrow your masters. Mangs go on another Iron Man run of Fire Emblem, Path of Radiance Maniac mode. Aw, shit. Here we go again. Alright. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for chapter 5, the defense chapter. The defense chapter. Uh, let's just make sure every... So, am I... Are we holding on to the speed wing? I don't know. Definitely giving one of the steel axes to Risto. Oh, video memes? Oh, right. I forgot, sorry. Sorry about that. Let me uh, let me let me open it up. Um, let's see. So we got one meme right here. Let's see. Already lost one person. Yeah, but it's not one important. It's just Boyd. Who cares? Oh, let's go! Is that what? What the? Did she just crit me? Um. <laughs> why are you clown emojing? Why are you? Why are you clowning me? What? Why are you doing this? Why? Why are you clowning me? This is what? not funny. You gotta, like... This is why I don't always open video memes for my... Because they're just not funny. Like, <laughs> I'm sorry, they're just not! Like, it's just random clips. There's... Okay, I don't know who it is, but there's just one guy. He kept sending me, like, these three-minute videos. And it was just basically, like, clips from my previous stream. Like, you gotta, you gotta put some effort in, you know? You gotta make them actually funny to watch. Like, sorry, but, like... Some people are like, Max, why don't you watch my video? Because they fucking suck. That's <laughs> that's why. Because <laughs> they're not funny. And I don't know how to tell it to you without being mean. Yeah, the clown emojis are back. Alright, let me... Um... Max do not care about his fans. I'm just awful. I'm just like Sniper Wolf. Careful, chatter. I'll start doxing you guys too. Yeah, like, uh, why test the... White Testify, he lives in Portugal. Uh, Inkling lives in France. Davis G lives in America. JP Gaming lives in Brazil. Short lives in Italy. Serithos lives in... Uh, Hanako lives in Brazil, I know that much. I actually know your address, Hanako. I actually know your address. Did you guys know I know where Hanako lived? I actually know her exact address, because uh, we were trying to figure out... Because Bethany and I wanted to travel to Rio de Janeiro, and we were trying to figure out how long it would take Bethany to... Uh, Hanako to walk from her home to Rio de Janeiro. It was like seven days. So she sent me her address. So I can actually... If I go into our chat logs right now, I can probably pinpoint Hanako's address, and I can dox her. Just, then I'll become Sniper Wolf. 
Isn't that something, hmm? Mm -hmm. Better be careful what you say to me, Hanukkah. Better be careful what you say to me. Just saying. Alright, let's try and use up some of these low H low vulnerabilities, shall we? Uh, oh, we had, we do actually have an Iron Axe. That's good. Let's put that on Titania. I want to be a little bit careful with Titania that we don't... Because I really don't want to, like, throw away stuff. Alright, so we have this on Ike. That's good enough. So we don't have Void, which is actually a bit of a problem. Uh, I think we're, we'll keep the Steel Rance on Gatry for now. Javelin on Gatry, too. I like to put... Titania and Gatry on the front lines to begin with. And then we'll do Ike Oscar here, probably. So we'll just do these two. I do like to keep one of them in the bush and another one here. Um, Speed Wings to Oscar. Ah, I don't know, man. I really don't know. I, for this map, it's actually dangerous to give Speed Wings out. And the reason is... If you want to take a picture of Hanako's house, you have to go to Brazil. Now you can just look at it in Google Maps. But yeah, I mean, let's be real. We're not going to make Hanako's neighborhood any less safe than it already is. It is Brazil, after all. So. Alright. There we go. So. I think we'll start by sending Ike down here. And we'll probably let Lish Shinom be part of the wall, I think. We'll put... Oh! Oh! I ran right into those! Um, does he have his trap? No, he does not. So we want to use the Hand Axe here. Like so. Uh, honestly, I might just keep Titania here. I think that's probably not a terrible idea. We'll keep Oscar right here. For this Iron Lance. We could attack and then shove with Soren. But I don't see the point. He's just gonna take damage. Actually, um could shove with Soren like so. I mean it's it's chip damage, I guess, so it can't be bad, right? Uh let's see. And then we'll do just we'll just shove like so. Just shove him out of the way. You need Shinon to block. Not on the first turn, no. I don't. Oh, hi. 81% chance to hit, and, and it missed. That's actually kind of impressive. Look at that. Oh, sorry. The Super Chats. Uh, Mood donated 20 Don Donkey Kongs to Super Chat. Please read North Korea newsletters on your channel. I don't know. I don't want to get demonetized. You got to be a little bit careful about that, actually. Theo Disiru donated 4.99 to Super Chat. Just did my Unifysics entrance XM today and bottled it. Please cheer me up with your awful gameplay minks. What does bottled mean? Does it mean to fail? This is the first time I hear that. Bottled? So you, you just you just you just, you just flunked. That that's what that means, right? That's kind of interesting. But yeah, I, I hope to uh, I hope to I hope to cheer you up. Honomori donated 20 Donkey Kongs. Only one guy hates a Bundy, the scat poster. Yeah, there's one guy on Feg who really hates a Bundy for some reason. I don't really know why. I really don't know why. Alright, those are the super chants that I missed. Thank you guys, I appreciate it. Sorry, sometimes I'm just very focused on the gameplay, you know? Uh, okay, so... We probably want to help... I think I'd very much like to get Oscar into the bush, so I think I'll do this. I think Ike can probably handle not being in the bush right now. And then, uh, maybe we can even... Can we kill this guy with Soren? We can. There we go. And then, I'm actually... Oh, wait. No, shit. I'm used to having Void here. I actually need to keep Oscar here. Yeah, I need to, I need to keep Oscar right here. Would you ever visit the Amazonas? Or the Amazon? Hmm. Gotta be honest, I haven't really thought that much about it. Um, like, what is there to do in the Amazonas? <laughs> Bottling is a British face. Ah, okay. First time I hear it. 
Kind of funny. All right, we got to churn our way through these guys somehow. I really... Oh, there's the torch. Very nice. Uh, I think... Uh, I wish I had someone to shove wrists, but I don't. So I think we'll just shrug a vulnerary for now. Can't be too careful, right? Wrist is, is in a bad spot here because... Actually, I'm kind of terrified about Ike here, if I'm going to be completely honest. I think... Uh, no, I can't do that. Because Ike... He doubles so many people. Uh, I'm worried that he's gonna... Oh, mo both of these guys are in for a while, so I think he'll be okay. I think they'll go for Oscar anyway, so it's fine. What are doing the Amazon die by Kamian's drag or is his mother disease? <laughs> Sounds well. Sign me up. I mean, I generally want to travel more. Traveling is great. But I've decided to postpone my travels until I get married, and then I can travel with my fiancé, which I think is a better way to spend my travel money. I was actually going to take a trip to Japan uh, around sometime this year. But then I was like, you know, I'm getting I'm getting married next year, and uh, I, I think I'd rather just go on vacation with my fiancé rather than travel alone. Like, my, my, my bachelor days are over, guys. It's time for me to... It, it's time for me to settle down. Uh, that's not a kill. Soren, my man. Why are you like this? This is actually kind of difficult, not gonna lie. So I really want to get Titania down here. Um, ah, for fuck's sake. These guys have swords, so... I probably need to equip my steel weapons if I wanna, if I wanna deal with them. There we go. Katana Manx will return someday. I think what I'm going to do here is I'm going to heal Oscar, and then I'm just going to shove Riss away. Or maybe I'll actually probably have to rescue him and chug a Vulnerary with Ike. Hit points, magic, skill, and rest. Let's go. Uh, can you... Oh, shit. You can't rescue him, can you? Ah, Riss, you're so bad. I hope I don't need to heal next turn. So here's the question. Is it safe? Is it safe to put Soren here? Can I can I kill this guy with Soren? I, probably not. But I'm gonna try anyway. And then Oscar. I really don't like Oscar tanking these two guys, I'm not gonna lie. I really don't like it at all. Just move Soren in with Ike. And he dies so fast though, and there's javelins there, so I really don't know if that's a smart idea. Okay. Another level up for Ike. Let's go. Oh my god. 13 strength. Let's go. 13 strength. Let's go. This is great. Okay. Soren is actually exposed now. I hope he'll be okay. I think he's okay. Oh, Gatry's gonna kill a lot of these guys now. I do want to kill the boss with Titania, but I think I need to give her a hammer for that. So I might trade the hammer over and try to kill the armor knight. We'll see. She has the torch on her, so we'll see if she can do something. She takes... Okay, interesting. She doesn't double these guys. Okay. Yeah, I got a really good Ike, right? So, I think what I'll do is... Hit points, speed, and defense. Soren is exposing himself in front of the enemy army. army. Yeah, it's awful, isn't it? So, if I can get the hammer over on Titania... Oh, there we go. This is, this is the problem. This is what I'm scared about. I'm tired. I've been at work all day. Oh! Let's go! Let's go! Nice! Oh, wow! Crazy! Damn! Let's go! Okay, Titania cleaning out some enemies. That's good. That's good. You can clean out. Okay, so what turn are we on right now? We are on turn four. So we got to kill the boss in the next two turns. Where's the hammer? There's the hammer. Can, can Oscar kill him? He can. We can give the hammer to Titania. It is possible. I just wish there was a way for them to swap their positions. I guess I could... Honestly, I could put Shin on in, in his position. And honestly, I think it's probably a good idea that I do that. You know what? It's fine. I'll put Oscar right here. I'll put Ike here. Kill the hammer, which drops. 
Can Titania one round the boss with a hammer? I don't know if she can one round him. Not sure, actually. But I'll take the hammer. And I will probably pop an elixir. I don't need to pop the elixir, actually. But it's also nice to have it? I actually don't know. I'll pop- I'll equip the Iron Axe to make it more likely that I- that I'll double these guys. Oh, so what do we have here? We have Iron Lances, Iron Swords. Can- can Soren kill this guy? He can, but he fucking dies on the counterattack. That's awful. Oh, okay, let's go. Hey, Mangs, recent addition here. I have a question about weapons. Everyone here have talked about Fire Emblem as trashed on Axis. How legitimate is that to say? Well, it depends, on my, it, it depends from game to game. I mean, Axis are really good in some games and really bad in others. I think it's a bit of a noob trap to bash on Axis, if I'm going to be completely honest. And the reason is, I think, when you're new to Fire Emblem, you have a very tenuous relationship with RNG. Um, you tend to notice your misses more then they actually occur. Uh, so it's a very complicated question, and maybe something I should make a video about, honestly. Um, but it's like... <sighs> new beginners don't like to take chances, and they definitely don't like it when they miss. And I find that players who are new to Fire Emblem get very angry when they miss. And they tend to kind of blame the game. Oh, worst game. Oh, this is so bad. Rah, 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 rah. Like... So... Uh, is it actually legitimate? In FE6, axes are very bad. There's almost no disputing this. Uh, because in FE6, FE6 axes have some of the lowest accuracy in the game. And this does make them very hard to use. Alright, kill this guy, Titania. So I'm going to send Titania in. Use a torch, I think. So what turn are we? This is turn 5 out of 6, right? Yeah, so the boss has already started moving. So I think what we want to do is we want to equip a hand axe. Use a torch. And then we want to move all the way down here. Maybe not all the way down. Yeah, oh. Hmm. Maybe not that much. Uh, well. Well. That was a lot of enemies. Maybe a tad more enemies than I'm comfortable killing. Um, that was a lot of enemies. My goodness, why are there so many enemies? That was a lot of enemies. I could have set this kill up for Soren, actually. Uh, yeah, that's kind of terrifying. Uh, we'll see. We'll see how go how well it goes. I mean, Titania is pretty good. It's kind of it's almost impossible to lose her. So we'll we'll see. Uh, I'm gonna go get a- I can't watch this. I'm- I'm too scared. I- I can't watch this. Um, oh shit. Okay, this is fine. Okay, I- I'm gonna-
die yet? Did she die yet? Is she okay? Is she okay? 40% hit rights, okay. Alright. She's doing well! She's doing really well! Oscar got speed? That's great. Mmm. Look at that. That's good. I had nothing to worry about, you guys. I had nothing to worry about. Okay, so they have about 40% hit rate against her, which is pretty good. The hand axe did break, though. <laughs> um, so the question is, can she... Wait, one, two... Can the arm... Can the boss... Oh, he has a javelin. Oh, that's not good. 18% chance to hit? What the... F Are you serious? Well, looks like he... <laughs> There's too many fucking enemies on this map. Um... Unless we could, like, somehow magically make it out of here with Oscar. No. Yeah, it doesn't look like we're gonna get the Asher icon, you guys. Um, yeah, it doesn't look like we're gonna get the Asher icon, sadly. Shove Oscar. But that would require Oscar to be very far in the front lines. You can't shove mounted units, so... You can't shove horses. No, you cannot. Yeah, this isn't possible. If the guy attacked me in melee, I think I could have killed him. Because I'm pretty sure Titania doubles him and hits him pretty hard with the Iron Axe. That's too bad. Kill the soldier and then Kanto into position? Bruh, he's just gonna javelin me. There's no point. You can shove mounted unit with Lagoose? Can you? I thought that was a myth. I thought that was a myth. Uh, should we replace Shinon with Oscar? Probably a good idea, I think. I'm pretty sure that's a myth. I don't think I've ever been able to verify that for myself. They have higher... and yeah, maybe they can, actually? I don't remember. But I do know. But I'd like to send Gatcha over here to get some chip experience. It's how you're supposed to do the stealth chapter. Oh, I guess you're right, actually. Yeah, now that you mention it. I'm definitely not stealthing the chapter again, though. Fuck that shit. Fuck that shit. She's not too fat. She's too thick. Mind your manners, boy. She's too thick. Well, it looks like Gatry is able to finish off a lot of the weakened units that Titania wounded, so... At least I'm getting some nice experience out of this, which is nice. Come on, Gatry, why are your hit rate so low, man? 68%? Come on. 72%? Where's this guy's skill? Do, 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 do. I get oh harp. There's the boss. Hi there. Oh wow. So I damaged him. We got it, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen. We got him. Boss took uh, one look at Gatry and decided to leave. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. I like that. That's funny. 
All right, so we are going on to chapter six with Boyd still dead. Ah. I'm actually gonna make a save stay here because I want to use this footage for a video I'm making. Are there new memes? Uh, chill, guys. Chill. We just we literally just did meme review. Is this the uh, okay? This is the escape chapter. This one's always a little tricky, but you can route it pretty easily if I remember correctly. We just use Titania a lot. Um, I think that's how I usually do it. I just send. Here's the problem, though. I might need to give her the. Oh shit! Wait a minute. Can I still take the? Uh, can I still take the? Ah uh... oh, shit! When's Gatry coming back? I forgot to take his shit. Ah, uh, I was gonna take the javelin from Titania. And, yeah, it comes back next chapter. I gotta remember to take a shit then. Um, that's actually kind of important. This chapter is tricky because you don't have a lot of resources for it. He comes. Stop lying, chat. Um, so I think so. We have mostly like steel lances and steel bows. I just like to, like, thunder out here with Titania, just kill an archer, and then, like, kill as many of these guys as possible. And then just kind of stick in the woods. I think that's usually the best way to clear this. This map is always a little tricky. Pole axe energy. You do get a pole axe in this chapter. I was right. I forgot about that. But yeah, this is mostly a Titania fest for sure. When is Boyd coming back? He's never coming back. Manx, is your emulator bugged? What do you mean? It's not bugged. It's 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 like there's a couple of graphical glitches every now and then, but that's just that's just that's just um a dolphin being dolphin, you know. No. 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 No! Echoes, please! Echoes, please! Stop, Echoes! No! Oh my goodness. Ah, there we go. That's the one I was looking for. Donation goal to play Clash with animations on. You're insane. That that's not fun. I'm sorry, it's not. To quote Blizzard, you think you want it, but you don't. But yeah, it's it's this is basically just Titania's territory right here. Like that that is really what it is. This is this is Titania's playground, and it's like this entire battalion of soldiers, as much as I would have liked to feed them to my other guys. It is Titania who will... I, one thing that I can do is I can attempt to pull one of the archers over to Soren right here. And that's actually not a terrible idea. Put Soren right here. So I don't think the art... No, yeah, I can put... I can put Ike where... I can put Ike where Soren is. Or Ike where Oscar is. And I can move Soren down here. And the archer might go for him, maybe. We'll see. But yeah, you also you also get okay. Never mind. He goes for Titania because she doesn't fire back. This map is just kind of dumb. You can stealth it, but I find that it just makes the map harder. It's better to just let Titania deal with all the grunts. Um. Polax RNG time. Well, we're not gonna face the Polax right away. Last time Soren died to crit here. Oh, that's right, he did. I forgot about that. That was dumb. Magnus, why do you like Path of Radiance? I like the characters. I unironically do like some of the maps. I like the girls. They had some of the Talia's games got some of the best waifus. Uh, I like the music. I like the bonus experience. I like the supports. I love the base function. 
I like I like a lot about this game. I really do. Unless, yeah, this is this is the Polex guy, so we gotta be careful about about yeah. Always like to put Titania in a thicket if at all possible. I like the story. I like Ike. I like uh, just a myriad of things I really like about Path of Radiance. I think it does a lot of cool things. Titania's bushes. We're so back. Yeah, that, that was a meme too, I remember. Titania's bush. Alright. Let's go, Oscar. Nice one. So some of those archers are going to go for Ike. I'm okay with that. Oh, Titanium. The Polax guy might not actually be able to attack Titania anymore. Um, no, actually. Interesting. Okay. I'm okay with that. I think I'm actually going to use my Regal Sword because it's lighter. And it's got some crit on it. Yeah. Okay, it looks like the Regal Sword is working properly now, actually. So here, we gotta be very careful. Uh, I think we wanna put Titania here, and then I think we wanna... Okay, we wanna be very careful with Oscar here. In fact, I think I won't attack at all here. So, I want to... Okay, so let's see. The Polax can go for Riss. Titania can take the Polax. I think this is safe for Riss. He's gonna take the Mage, but that's fine. Yeah, I will not attack with Oscar here. I will just wait. The Polax is actually a little bit scary against Oscar. Not against Titania, though. No, what are you doing? What are you doing? No! Why would you do this? Oh, no. Ow! Okay, that's the Polax. Oscar took it like a champ, though. So it's fine. And yeah, Ike just got... Okay. That actually went a lot better than I thought. Oh my god, I got 14 speed on Ike. I got 14 speed on Ike, you guys. Okay, so here, you know what I'm actually gonna do? Yeah, you can see the pole axe is just... The pole axe isn't that good against Titania. But, she gets it, which is nice. Um, okay, so how scary is this guy to Oscar? Eight, that's not so bad. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Uh Ah shit. Uh okay, I got you do get a men staff after this. You gotta be a little cautious, that's all. Good use of the you get a fire tome next chapter, it's fine. Oh shit, I forgot about that guy. Careful not to run out of tomes. He's got 21 uses left. It's fine. Fire Tome sucks. Well, not if Soren gets some strength. There we go. That's how we do it. Oh, wait. Shit. He's just going to attack. I can't surround him. Actually, he's just going to go for Riss, isn't he? I think he's just going to go for Riss. Strength uh, counteracts weapon weight, tome weight in Path of Radiance. So if Soren, if Soren gets, uh, well, that didn't really work out the way I thought it would. Um, yeah, turns out that <laughs> turns out the AI is really dumb and doesn't. God damn it! I was gonna train Soren.
God damn it. God damn it. Oh well. It's fine. Alright. We should probably heal up before we start pulling more units. If you unequipped everyone, you could have farmed. Well, I'm not that crazy. Okay, he's actually already moving. All right, so these guys will actually have AI to like move towards you when you're low, when you're close to them. I actually didn't know that. That's interesting. That is interesting. Could hammer him? Sure, why not? Leave him low for someone else to finish him off. Train Soren on that knight. He's gonna eliminate him, dude. There's not gonna be much training to do. He's just gonna kill him. Oh wow. Uh, okay. All oh, right, they have priests. Cool. Hmm. This can be exploited. Now we can train Soren. There you go. He actually gets pretty decent ship damage from this, believe it or not. It's not terrible. Uh, any javelin? Okay, this guy actually does have a javelin, so I gotta be a little bit careful about that. Soren is still. Soren is still at the point where he's very frail, so if I'm not careful, he could, he could kick the bucket here, which... Why does he do so little damage? Welcome to Path of Radiance Maniac Mode. Enemies are very bulky here. They have just a lot of HP and defenses compared to your units. That's just how they work. I want Titania to hammer me. Of course you do. All right, okay. Waifu check, guys. Who, who's your tallest waifu? Let me let me see how shit your taste is. Let's hear it. Hammer? Nah. The hammer sucks, dude. All right, missed. Okay. Jail. 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 Soren. Alinsha. Alinsha's good. good. Alinsha's always a good choice. Skill unlock. Okay, a terrible wrist level up, but what else is new? Okay, I could exploit this if I wanted to. I don't think I will, though. Oh! Okay, good job, sorry. Good job. He's probably gonna kill him now. Oh, wow. Only four dead. What the? Why are you so bad? Never mind. Why are you so good? Why are you so good? Let's go! Let's go! I don't want him running back and heal. <coughs> oh. oh no. Careful, Ike. What a mad lad. This is what I'm talking about. I like the idea of generics being similarly strong as your players. After all, why would the generics be bad? Yeah, I mean, this, you know, some people like strong generics, other guys like weak generics. It kind of depends on your preferences. Some games do do like throwing elite units at you. Some people get frustrated when the generics are so much stronger than the quote-unquote heroes. Oh, they're trading about vulneraries. Yes, Boyd is dead. What do you think the death counter means? My goodness. No, I put him there for fun. No, Iron Lance. No. Alright, I'll put... I'll heal up Ike, and then I'll put him on the front lines. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just... <coughs> Did I just fucking break my heal staff? Oh. I was not paying attention to my heal staff, ladies and gentlemen. That's not good. Uh, shit. That's not good. Alright, we're using Titania. Screw this, we gotta... Ah, oh, shit. I know you- No! No! A blank level up? No way! No! No! You're shitting me right now! This is not happening! 
This is not happening. This is just not happening. A blank level up? Are you shitting me? Titan is still good, but this sucks. You need your stats on Maniac Mode. Like, every level up is important on Maniac Mode. Also for Titania. It helps her... It helps her stay relevant in the late game. Oh, this is sucks. Put my hopes and dreams on the death counter. Yeah. Do you guys know how rare it is to get a blank level up? Do you guys know? Do you guys know how unlucky you have to be to get a blank level up? It is rare. In some games, the the RNG actually rolls once or twice whenever you get a blank level up, and it re-rolls. Yep. And my healer is useless right now, so any damage that I sustain has to be healed up by vulneraries. I got five of them in Undone Saga. Cry about it. <laughs> it's okay when my game does it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well... You know, it's like with women. You can't have them all. You know, that's just how it is. Some level ups are bad. Some level ups are good. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. I mean, not that I would want all women when I got my lovely fiance, but you know, like theoretically. She's, she's, she's working now, so hopefully she won't catch that. Skill, speed, luck, defense. Oscar's getting fast. You know what the problem is? Oscar's not very strong. That's the problem. That is actually a problem. Okay, I don't think we have time to fuck around with these healers. We're just gonna bonk them. You did get a blank level up with Bethany. <laughs> ah... Okay, so yeah, now he sends everyone to attack us. We probably want to choke up by the bridge, I think. The level up system should have a minimum cap to le I think you should... I mean, that's what they did in Tree Houses with the students, at least. Uh, they did... Um, in Tree Houses, I very much believe that they... Um, In True Houses, they actually did it, made it so that your students can only ever... They can't get blank level ups. For some reason, the teachers can, which is kind of interesting. Ba -da -ba -da 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 -da. Is this engaged music? I think this might be engaged music. I think this is engaged music. All right, let's kill this uh, mage. Engage has great music, though. You can't really, you can't really fault its soundtrack. It's amazing. Okay, I'll let them charge me. I think. Oh yeah, it's Brodia. Yeah, it's, it's one of the very chill tracks, though. Oh, I love this track. It's great. This is an absolutely amazing track. Really good track. All right, let's just kill the archer. We don't have healing right now, so we, we have to be a very very cautious. We could do a. Uh, I think I think we'll I think we just let Titania deal with this one, guys. I think we just let Titania deal with this one, guys. Maybe heal up Ike just a little bit. Yeah, we're uh, we're letting mommy deal with this one. Oh, shit. Oh, 
Oh, wow. Ike mad. 4% crit. Let's go. I think Titania one rounds with the hammer. Yep, she does. Mangs, would you place Engage High in your favorite Fire Emblem games? You know what? Um, I really need to remake that video. Because it's kind of outdated. And, and uh... I think if, you, if you're if you expecting me to give Engage a glowing review, then uh, you're probably going to be a little disappointed, but... Because um, that's not happening. I'm sorry, but, but <laughs> it's not. Where would I rate Engage, though? That's a good question, because gameplay is does matter. I think what I'm going to do if I make a new one is I'm going to rate them on several factors. I'm gonna rate them on things like I'm gonna do like multiple ratings per game. I'm gonna do like story, aesthetics, uh, gameplay. I think I'm gonna give three ratings for each game. I'm gonna give it a story rating, an aesthetics rating, and a gameplay. So I think those are like the three core tenets of Fire Emblem. A aesthetics and is like presentation. That's like music, graphics, waifus, uh, how everything looks. A story is like the writing. And then you got gameplay, which is just how fun the game is to play. So I think I think you need to do three ratings per per game. And Engage would actually score very high on gameplay, but it would score very poor on presentation. The music would pull it up a, a lot for sure. But uh, I am not really a big fan of how the game looks. Um, but the writing would be like a one out of ten, maybe. I don't know if I could rate zero out of ten, maybe. Alright, uh, I don't think these guys move. I, I I have never seen them move. But just to be sure, I'm popping a, a Bonerary on Oscar. What about characters? Uh, yeah, I think that would maybe be included in the writing, maybe? Or, actually, yeah, that's a good choice. Maybe I should, maybe, yeah. I don't want to make it too complicated, though. That's the thing. Engage to serve zero out of ten on writing. Yeah, it kind of does. It's really bad. The story's dog shit. Waifus were not interesting. Graphics were okay. Ah, Engage has some good waifus. Like I think Gold Mary is one of the better female designs to come out of Fire Emblem in a very long while. Uh, Gold Mary and Citrine are like very high up on my ranking. Um. But I will admit that the characters in general are not fantastic, yeah. Goldmer's personality is awful. I agree. I She was close to being perfect. They made her kind of like a trad wife, which is kind of cool. But then they, also, they made her a narcissistic trad wife, which is kind of sad. But Goldmer's design is great. She's really pretty. Like, it's a really unique design, too. Gold Murray got heavily censored. I've heard this, but I think the censorship is mostly related. Like, they toned her down a little bit. I know there's, like, one support where she cries about being fat because she, like, gained one pound. And she said her perfect waistline was ruined. And, like, they, they censored that for some reason. I'm not I'm not entirely sure why. I guess they, they didn't want to get canceled on Twitter or something. So they changed it to like, I don't remember what they changed it to, to be honest. She strips in front of Fram at some... Yeah, there's some there's some interesting supports there with Gold Mary for sure that I guess the West just didn't want to deal with. Yeah, there we go. And we want to we wanna make sure we escape with all our characters because it gives... Uh, it gives bonus experience to escape in this chapter, so we want to escape with everyone and do Ike lasts. The next chapter is a pretty tough one, if I remember correctly. That's the indoor chapter, right? Yeah. Where we get Mia! Who's going straight to the bench. Sorry to say, guys, but she is. Remember to escape with Void? He's already escaped. He's escaped life. And we get a mend, which is very nice. Do you only get that mend if Riss is present? Because I remember, I think Riss is the one who like picks it up or whatnot. 
All right, we're in chapter seven, guys. Well, that's very chill, my goodness. I do legitimately really like the score of Engage. I, I listen to it a lot. It's great. It's great for working. Very relaxing. Riz, I only know Riz. Are we going to beat it tonight, Manx? Playing very fast. Yes, I'm doing I'm doing maniac mode in one sitting. That sounds like hell. Dot Breadman donated five bucks. This is my first exposure to either Tellius game. Excited, excited to see shit go down. Well, I, I wouldn't say Maniac Mode is a very good first exposure to Tellius, um, because it's like kind of weird, uh, and it's not like the other games. So please do not judge the Tellius series by this. This is a difficulty that was caught in the European version of the game because it was so dog shit. This is a Japanese exclusive difficulty that was so bad and so untested that they removed it. Uh, I'm just playing it because I'm clinically insane. So, please do not judge Tellius by this first impression. This isn't how the games normally go. So, um... Do you not trust Donlot? Uh, Donlot says a lot of weird shit. I think... I think Don I take about one out of five things Donlot says seriously. Uh, so, sometimes he'll have really good ideas, like Braum, but then he says really stupid shit. So... Anyway, we're gonna do a short meme review here. A special message from Kim Jong himself? Oh no, he watches my streams. Yeah, I'm not gonna play North Korean news on the channel, uh, Jet Black. Sorry about that. That's uh, that's asking to be demonetized. Ugh. Let's see. Oh my god, someone made a clown Bethany emoji. That's kind of funny. <laughs> yeah, like, sorry, Fear, I don't believe you. You have zero experience. Like, how could you have won? You're dumb. Yeah, here's the clown Bethany emoji. I don't know if I want that in my chat, to be honest. Maybe it'll help. Maybe it'll stop Bethany from spamming. In footballing, Bottler mean refers to a player who initially plays well but makes huge mistakes or let the teams down when it really matters. Yeah, missing a penalty, missing an easy chance, losing your temper, and getting set off. I didn't know that. That's the first time I hear about this term. All right, let's take a look at this Fire Emblem list. Uh, engage on top, immediately discarded. I'm not watching the rest of this shit. Terrible. Absolutely fucking awful. Know the difference. Cat woman, cat lady, cat girl. Yeah. One is hot, one you don't want to be. One, um... Tells a lot about you. Let's just put it that way. Ah, uh, too complicated. Meme is too complicated. Live Boyd reaction, that's funny. <laughs> no Asher icon. I was so close to getting it though. This this meme again. I think that was all of them. Alright. Okay. So it's time for chapter seven. This one can be interesting, cause. Gatri and Shinon comes back, but then they immediately leave again, so we have to remember to, to unequip their, them. Although we probably want Gatri to have a Iron Lance in his inventory so he can fight, uh, because you do get him back. Uh, you can recruit him on the first turn, I think, but it's probably still a good idea for him to have like a Lance in his inventory. So we'll see about that. Nah... Nah. Nah. Ooh. That's my that's my jam. 
Oh, hi, PH. Boyd already dead. He sucks, though. Who cares? All right, everyone has what they need. We have a mend. We have... Uh... So I think I'm going to keep the short spur on Titania, because she needs to kill a lot of guys this turn. I really wish I still had my hand X. Um, she has the elixir, the torch, the vulnerary. I, Titania has to do a lot of heavy lifting this turn. I'm actually kind of worried, because Oscar only has 10 lance uses left, which is not great. But uh, yeah, Titania needs to just go ham and kill a bunch of guys here. I don't think there is a single mounted unit on this chapter, so... Boyd sometimes decides to level strength and speed, and then becomes an okay unit for the rest of the run. Low, yeah, I don't want to train him, because he just dies in the late game. Wasted experience, that's what he is. Alright, we're gonna have to rely on Ike here, but PH, look at my Ike. Look at my Ike. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. 13 strength, 14 speed on level 12. This is crazy. Okay. So, what we're going to do with Itania is we're just going to send her this way. And I think we can use, at least for this first turn, I think we can use the, the axe to start off with. I think we'll use the steel axe just to start things off with. Kill as many soldiers as we can, then we're going to swap to the short spare once we're closer to the north. There we go. I got a blank level up on Titania, which blows. That makes me very, very, very sad. I think it's okay for Ike to... He can wield the Steel Sword just fine now. Put Oscar next to him with his iron. Ah, that's the problem, though. That's the problem. We don't want... We, do, we don't want Oscar to see too much combat. So I think we're just going to do this for now. Uh, ooh, wait a minute. We got, yeah, these guys need to not go for Riss. That's very important. If he wants to go for Soren, Nah. Alright, I forgot about this girl. Mia armpits. Go away, chat. Why are you like this? I need to kill a lot. Like, this map just got so many enemies. It's absolutely crazy. I swear, you get another blank level up. Okay. That's better. That's much better. That is much better. Oh, my goodness. Much better. Uh, so unexperienced Talis player here. Why is she so bad? Oh, we're gonna talk about Mia, don't you worry. Like, on the next turn, I'll, I'll show you Mia. I think she comes with a band, though, so that's... That's somewhat useful, I guess. Titania redeemed herself. Redeem! She redeemed herself. One thing I hate about this map is how much 1-2 range there is. It's so annoying. I really, really dislike it. So I think it might be time to pull up, whip out the short spare for Titania. Oh, she recruits herself. Nice. Alright, so Mia. Um, she's a level 6 Myrmidon. Uh, she kind of sucks. Um, I don't know why she's... I think that's a modification. That's not how she normally looks, guys. Uh, she's normally a different color, I'm pretty sure. Um, people like Mia because she's a Myrmidon. Uh, she comes with Vantage, which kind of sucks. Uh, she has good like, skill and speed. And the problem with Maniac Mode is she doesn't get the 15% crit as a Swordmaster, which makes, makes her so bad. Uh, she's very frail, very hard to level up. If you do level her up, she can kill things. 
but I really don't like Mia. She's too frail. She takes too much investment. Look at how she performs against enemies in her joining chapter. Yes, I know this is maniac mode, but it's still kind of bad. Now, that being said, uh, we probably still need to use her here because uh, we're kind of fucked otherwise. Okay, this guy needs to die. Speed! 15 speed, let's go! Magic Ike! Not Magic Mike, Magic Ike. Uh, does Oscar double this guy, I wonder? He does, actually. 14, and uh, what do we do here? 14. That is not enough! That is not enough. I guess what we can do is we can, if we put Oscar back here, I actually have an idea. We attack here. Are you serious? Are you serious? You get hit by a 24? And then we send you back here, and then we go like so. I got two very good levels on Soren. Really good levels on Soren, in fact. So let's see how the third level goes. Okay, still magic, though. A couple of strength level-ups would be nice. Not gonna lie. Ah, shit. This is not good. Um, well, I guess we have no choice but to do this. So I think it's probably time to bring out the short spare at this point. Um, yeah, I think so. Then we'll do a vulnerary. We gotta try and stop that thief from entering the treasure chamber. So she's definitely gonna break the short spare this turn. That's okay, though. Personally, I don't give XP to, X to Ileana slash Soren. Uh, beyond level 10, I just use Magister and Staff Bot with them. A waste of experience. Yeah, I mean, I think Soren is legitimately very good when trained. Uh, he, like, can cap speed and magic and support Ike. I agree on Ileana, though. She should probably be early promoted at level 10 and then just turn into a Sage and then just use for healing. I think that's probably the best way to use Ileana, but we'll see. It is nice to have a good mage who can kill a lot of stuff, and I legitimately like that she has Shade. It does actually make it a little easier to keep her alive. So we'll see. Tormod is definitely a level 10 staff bot. I agree. That's the best way to use him. All right. Dodge to 46. That's good. Okay. I don't like how that fighter is blocking Titania. That's actually really annoying. Uh, but yeah, we got to kill this guy. Oh shit, we cannot. What? Oh no. She doesn't have the off. She doesn't have the speed to double. That's because she got that blank level up. Well, she can still kill the thief, though. At least if she hits. This chapter looks... This chapter is chaos. You're not wrong. This chapter is... Okay, Sor... Oh! Soaring doubling. Hallelujah. Soren's doubling. What a, what a mad lad. There we go. Very cool. Riss is dangerously wounded. He probably needs to back off and pop a, pop a concoction or a vulnerary, I think. There we go. And Mia, are you in one-shot range? No, you're not. In fact, you can take two hits. Wow. Huh. Look at that. She can take two hits from this guy. Mia good. Okay, that's the... War yeah, I want that. I want that. Oh, I can actually let one of the thieves come for me. You see, Titania is actually kind of taking damage here, which is a little scary. Um... I always get a little worried about her in this chapter. Luckily, though, it looks like she's gonna they're not gonna attack her anymore, which is good. There goes the short spare. Armpits will carry. You guys are the worst. Alright, there comes Patrine. And then comes Ike's dad. 
Oh, he doesn't display his hit rates. That's sad. I love how Ike runs up in the cutscene while ever. Oh my goodness. Hello, Maniac Mode. How do you do? Alright, so yeah. This is this is scary shit. Luckily, we got Shin on here now. He can kill the thief. Get that word staff. I gotta remember to take it off him, though. That's very important. And Gatry, normally, he does pretty well here. And he does have a javelin. But one thing we gotta remember is there is an armor slayer here somewhere. I don't remember where. Yeah, there. I don't remember if he charges you. But we gotta be careful about that. Is this, a, this is a kill boss chapter, so before we kill B-17 Balmer, we have to make sure that we, uh, we have to make sure we trade away stuff. He's not hard to kill, and he drops the mage ban, which is good for Soren, I think. Actually, I think Soren actually appreciates the thief ban more, because his skill and speed. So, speaking of Soren, he's definitely getting this kill. Oh, it's Route. Never mind, it's Route. Yeah, I call him B-17 Balmer. He, that's just his name. And I'm actually just gonna let this thief come towards the chests. And I don't really want to pull these guys, so I'm just gonna stay back for now. Yeah, I think he's safe. No one can attack him. This is good. Boss abuse on this chapter to get Gatry to a level 1 general, then return to Astrid readily, then you can focus on training Braum. Problem with boss abuse on this particular chapter is that uh, at some point your damage output will exceed the healing, but yeah, you can actually you can actually boss abuse here. Nice! Strength and defense, let's go. What else do you need, really? Not bad. Max, you're using Titania too much. I'm using her exactly as much as I should, which is all the time. What? Hey! Hey! Not my vulneraries! I better get that back. I better get that back. You better give me that back. Right now. Brazil moment. Ugh. Why are Brazilians like this? Why are Brazilians like this? It's the worst. It's the worst! Yeah, I know the. I know there's an armor slayer there. To be fair, he doesn't do that much to Gatry. But it, it is smart to know that he's there. Um, it's like, if, if we calculate the actual might of this guy, it's like 16 plus 8. It's just like 22. So he does like 4 damage to Gatry. He might double him, but the armor slayer is very heavy, so I don't think so. I think we're fine here. Uh, I think we're apt. There's like, there's one. Isn't there a poison lance here somewhere? I seem to remember that Gatry can get poisoned, but I'm not entirely sure if that's the case. There we go. I think I'll back off a little bit with Shinon. Maybe I'll even help do. Nope. Nope, not gonna help with damage here. <laughs> the Armor Slayer is not gonna kill Gatry, guys. It's not that dangerous. It does like 8 damage tops. But it can damage him, though. So that is something you gotta be a little bit careful about. Uh, I don't think this guy drops his Vulnerary, guys. I think I just... I lost it for good now. What? Come on! Come on! Come on! Alright, let's go, Oscar. Strength, speed, let's go! Let's go! Ah, oh, Mia, we need you. We need you, Mia. We need you, Mia. Kill for the armpits. No, I'm not feeding Mia kills. Stop it. We're feeding it to Soren. Thief experience is actually really nice. Okay, let's go. Magic speed. Let's go. Skill speed. I'm okay with that, too. 
11 speed on Sorin is actually pretty damn good. I think this is the guy that drops his Fire Tome. So Sorin will get his Fire Tome now, which is really good. And the song has gone on for a little bit too long. Oh, definitely not. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. This is a nice track. Engaged music is complete trash. You take that back, you stupid Frenchman. LOL, Armor Slayer mists. One shot! <laughs> Armor Slayer got freaking one shot. What the hell? That's funny. I seem to recall one of these guys having a poison lance. Did I just make that up in my head? Oh, lance rank on Gatry. Let's go. Maybe I did make it up in my head. Anyway, I got a great Gatry now. Look at me. He's doubling armor knights. That's great. All right, Gatry's about to level up again. Oh, this is the guy that drops his fire tome. Uh, I guess I'll just kill him and then run over to Soren. Actually, I need to stay here. You probably remember the poison lance from the randomizer, right? Yeah, that might be it. Ah, yeah, you're right, you're right. That's probably... I had this weird notion that... Four hounds are fangs wannabe. Oh, yeah. Of course they're inspired by the fangs. <laughs> Zero damage. Good job. Yeah, of course they are. I mean, that, that goes without saying, really. Donate to play the four hounds music during the entirety of Clash. <laughs> oh, you know not what you wish for, my friend. So, fun little thing, I know that this is like old trivia to most of you, but there might be some people who don't know. As long as Ike is adjacent to Soren, he protects him from critical hits. It's the only interaction like that in the game. So, as long as you have Ike next to Soren, Soren has 100% crit avoid. He can never be crit by any anything. This is the only interaction. So, it's just something... Yeah, it's kind of cool. Yeah, so uh, Ike gives him... Yeah, they have a... They have a... Yeah, gay. Yeah, gay. Bring on the gay jokes. So he, pr he protects him from critical hits. And it's kind of cool, right? Another fun little fact is that Titania has a 10% bond support with Grail. Despite the fact that Grail is never on the map as a playable unit. That hints at their... Ooh, very nice. That hints at their... Uh, they, they, it's very much implied that... That Titania had a big thing for Grail, like that they like. I don't think they ever like were a thing, but she definitely had a crush on him. Uh, should I do this? I guess I should. Ike protects Sora and Balls. Yeah, it's something that the community has a lot of fun with. Do 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 do. I think I will be safe here and do a vulnerary. Uh, I guess I could kill this mage with Titania. I probably wouldn't be the worst idea I ever had. Alinsha also protects Ike from crit. I did not know that. Really? So Ike has that interaction with uh, Alinsha as well? I didn't know that. That's actually really cool. Do, 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 do. That's cute. So wait, Alinsha protects Ike and not the other way around? That's kind of weird. Ragnell protects Ike from crit? I don't believe it does, no. I think now you're just saying things, I think. Anyway, Gatry is getting a ton of experience in this battle, and I'm here for it. Only problem is, I don't think he has... I don't think I have the lances to abuse, so... Alright, let's pull this guy in with Titania. She'll probably kill him, but that's fine. Uh, we want to probably conserve this men's staff just a little bit. These guys have a 1% crit chance against Gatry, which is... No, he has the... 
he has a 1% crit chance against them. That's how it works. Ike Excel is just a canonical pairing. I mean, if you've seen the outro cinematic of this this game, it's literally the two of them holding hands. They never really won anywhere with that, though. <clears throat> but I always interpreted them as being like the, ca the, the, the canon pairing. It just seemed not natural to me, but... I guess, like, a princess can't really marry a mercenary. Like, that would... That would kind of be dumb. They have no chemistry. I kind of agree. But Ike doesn't really have chemistry with anyone, though. He's kind of bland. Alright. Uh, I think I'll just heal up Ike and send him to fight the Armor Knights. That's, oh, actually, I'll just let Gatry do it. Why not? Hit points, skill, luck, and, resi and resistance. That's nice. Come on, give me a good track. No. Ah, there we go. That's the one I was looking for. So I guess I guess we just let Gatra kill all of these guys, right? That's that's what we're doing now. PH, I can't play freaking Dragon Force music on the channel. I'm gonna get demonetized, you idiot. Oh, they're running to get healed. That's cute. Do I not have chest keys? Oh shit, I forget they move. Oh shit, is Mia dead? Uh, do I have chest keys? Do I have chest keys? I don't know. Do I? I do, actually. No, I don't think I have a combo yet, so... Probably want to take uh, the speed wing just to be safe. There we go. First thing I do when I become dictator is ban Qua. To be fair, PH, I don't think there is a more frightening scenario that I can think about than you as a dictator. I'm gonna be completely honest. Like that, that is a fucking terrifying reality. That, can you guys imagine PH as the dictator of France? Like, that is... That is fucking nightmarish shit right there. Couldn't be worse than what we have, I mean... I mean... I guess, I guess... Oh shit, wait, what happened? Uh... Oh no! What did I do? Oh, I'm sorry, guys. I accidentally loaded a save state. Luckily, I made one. Okay, I'm so sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I I, I was going to click, and I, I accidentally loaded a save state. I'm so sorry. So sorry. So sorry. No, Soren wasn't gonna die. Come on. Let me just move this one around a little bit. There we go. He wasn't gonna die. Nothing changed. Yeah, sorry. Dolphin is a little bit finicky sometimes. It's very easy to load a state without meaning to. Run invalid, I know. I've been very good at conserving my Regal Surd this time. I feel like I don't really need it because Ike is so strong. But it might come in handy at some point. I know there's a lot of Cavaliers in the next chapter, so... We'll see about that. 
I'll open the chest with Oscar, I think. It's not like he's doing much. Do -do 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 -do. I'm gonna get the chests. Don't worry. My goodness. Some of you guys, I'm fairly certain you have OCD. I'm just gonna say. I feel like your biggest fear is that I won't open a chest. And I don't think I'm wrong. I think you guys have nightmares about me op not opening chests. <laughs> like, oh my god, Max! Do 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 do. All right, it looks like we're done with this map now, which is good. Max, because of the current units, you have Forge Mia. No, no, no. Not Forge Mia. No, you're wrong. Bad commentary. No Forge Mia. Advice disregarded. Opinion invalid. No, 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 no Forge Mia. They're gonna Forge Mia damn thing. We're not forging Mia anything here, chat. We get one forge next chapter, and we better use it wisely. That's all I'm gonna say. Forge a hand axe named Mia. You know what? That I can do. That I can do. Alright, I'm proud of Gatry this chapter. He's been, uh... He's been doing well. He's about to get another level up now. He has, uh, he has performed decently. So are we gonna taint a little bit with Soren on the boss here? I kinda want to. What does he have again? He has a skill. I forgot what it was. Get Miracle, it will save the run. Oh... My Gatry's leveling up pretty well. Oh my god, look at that! Look at that! Cap defense Gatry, let's go! Let's go. Who who is gonna take over the uh okay, so we wanna we wanna give away a lot of our equipment on Shinon here for sure. The ward staff. Uh, the steel bow, probably, as well. We want to make sure we get that. Because he's going to get a new one when he joins. Uh, Armor Slayer. We want to grab the Night Band, for sure. They put their stuff in the car. Are you sure? Are you absolutely sure about that? I feel like I've been trolled before on that. Oh, I just gotta check his skill. What skill does he have again? Doesn't he have a skill? Oh, I guess he doesn't. I was sure this guy had a skill. Alright. Uh, wow, zero damage. What about the fire tome? Does that do anything at all? No! It does nothing. Uh, then I really don't know, actually. Wow, look at that. That's actually pretty good. Uh, are you sure? No, I'm not giving it to Mia. Fuck off. Oscar could get some chip, I guess. Lag? I guess I should be a little bit cautious with my men's staff, but... Should I just kill the, kill the healer? I, I, I don't want to fuck around with this boss, guys. I know some people like tainting. I'm not going to taint. I'm just going to kill. Rip stream? No! Oh, uh, you're you guys are just fucking with me like you always do. Okay, got it. Got it. You're just fucking with me. Okay, we're gonna let Oscar kill this guy. I think we're just gonna let Oscar kill this guy.
Banned for not... Okay, there goes his lands, so... Are we just gonna keep the Steel Lance on Gatry? I don't know. Probably not. I guess, I guess Ike makes the more sense here. Whoa, so you're a mage. Like, you've seen a mage before, Ike. It's not that new. Oh my goodness. Magic Ike, let's go! Stream is dying, really? It's not dying on my end. Just, just refresh, I guess. Discard? No! I don't want to discard. I guess I have to discard a vulnerary. Okay, that's annoying. Okay, this cutscene is actually kind of cool. Ooh, that's loud. Alright, blah, blah, blah. Oh, shit. I guess we have to watch this. Yeah, we always have to watch this. This is gonna be like Chipmunk style. <laughs> uh, this is always entertaining. <laughs> <laughs> this is always so funny. Just refresh, I guess. I don't know. Stream doesn't work at all. I don't know. It's fine on my end. It'll come back, guys. It's okay. Just relax. It's probably just YouTube being weird. <laughs> Imagine you could just pick up the Ragnall now. Yeah, I know, right? Haha, <laughs> ha, Grail Weapon Triangle joke. They've been around since like 2008. That being said, the axe that he's wielding is really strong. The Irvin is crazy good. <laughs> Ike and the chipmunks. Experience gained. Alright. Oops, I forgot to save. That's fine, though. Oh. Why do you have the chipmunk voices? It's, it's because, um... It's because, um... The reason I have the ship is because I speed up the emulator, that's why. Alright, so uh, we got... I love this base, by the way. I think we're definitely doing Ike Oscar, right? Like, that is such a good support early on. So I think we do Ike Oscar B, Ike Soren A, and then we do Oscar Kieran A. So uh, I think that's probably okay. Yeah. Double Earth is really good. It, it's such a good support. Gives them so much avoid. It's great. We got a good Oscar, which is fine. Let's just... Amy's pretty hot, not gonna lie. There we go. I have to do these, sorry. And the completionist in me has to do this. Oh, hi, Rolf. I didn't know you were here. Alright, so we got some experience to give away, about three levels worth. Um, we could save it. We could give it to Soren. Uh, Earth Affinity is the best. Yeah, it's ridiculous how good it is. Uh, I like to put... We could put Miracle on Ike. I've never seen a proc. We could also put it on... I think Soren's luck is pretty shit, though. Like, who has the best luck here? Uh... If we put it on Ike, there's a chance 
that it could proc, I guess. Uh, we could also put it on Soren. Uh, I could give it to Riss. Yeah, I mean, that might actually save him. He does have good luck. Give it to Titania. It could say it could end up saving her life, actually. And she, she, my Titania does actually die quite a lot in the late game. So you know what? Sure. I mean, she does take a lot of hits on the late game. This could actually save her. So you know what? I think that's fine. Um. All right. Let's just do a complete reset of our inventories right now. We also gotta go do some shopping. So we have we don't have that much money. We gotta think about what we definitely need a lance for Oscar. That's for sure. Uh, do we have anything to sell? Uh, we have... Uh, can sell a torch for 200. I don't know if that's worth it. The bands are actually worth quite a lot. You can't give her soul later. Well, I don't think I want to, so it's fine. The speed wing. Yeah, so... Uh, I think my Soren is leveling speed to the... I don't really know who would benefit from the speed wing. I think I'll just hold on to it for now. But I definitely need to buy an Iron Lance for Oscar. Probably an Iron and a Steel Lance for Oscar, honestly. And then we need Hand Axes for Titania. She's going to be using quite a lot of them. I think we, we get probably two Hand Axes for Titania. Uh, we just got a Fire Tome for Sora, and I don't think we need to buy anything else. Uh, maybe a regular Heal Staff for Riss. There we go. Speedwing to Jill. Huh. It it's not a bad choice for her, honestly. It actually is not a bad choice for her at all. Now, we need to think about what kind of band to give to Ike. Uh, I think... Uh, let's give the more obvious... Uh, let's give the more obvious bands first. Uh, Polaxe and Steelaxe for Titania, probably. And the Elixir and the Vulnerary for her. Uh, I Titania... Probably the... Uh, I think I'm going to give the Knight Band to Titania, maybe, for more... Hmm... Yeah, Gatris Lance is in the convoy. You're right, guys. You're guys. I think I'll give the Night Band to Titania, because she's probably going to get a level up, and her defenses need to go up. As for Ike, I think just maybe the... He's, he's doing really well. I think maybe the uh, Fighter Band for him is probably what we want. Soren. can take the Wind Tome and the Fire Tome. He can probably get the... I do like the Mage Band on Soren, to be honest. But, uh... Oh, the Fighter Band on Soren for Strength is actually pretty funny. Mia needs the Fighter Band. I actually have to deploy her in this chapter because I don't have Boyd, so that's kind of funny, actually. I think we'll just put the Mage Band on him. Uh, Oscar... Oscar can get the Paladin Band, maybe, or maybe the Thief Band for extra. He can get the Paladin Band. Uh, Riss can just keep the... Uh, honestly, giving some speed to Riss is probably not a bad idea. And Mia can get the... I guess she can just get the Thief Band, or the Priest Band, or the Sword Band, I don't know. Archer, Thief, and Paladin all give speed. I guess she gets the Thief Band, then. Why is Mia pink? I have no idea. We messed around with the graphics of the Dolphin, that's all I know. So, uh... You lose Mia, you also lose the ban. Yeah, so I definitely gotta try not to lose her. Uh, here's the thing, though. I also think I'm gonna keep carrying additional ban. Uh, um, the sword band. We definitely want a ban for Ileana. I'll just put the sword. I'll 
I'll bring, bring like, the sword band for Ileana, I guess. I think it's, like, skill and speed, right? So it's okay. Honestly, I like the archer band on Soren. And I'll, I might put the mage band on Eliana. Or I could give the archer band to Eliana for more speed. That could also work. I gotta be careful now, though. You're absolutely right, chat. I have to be careful, because... Uh, if I lose these units... Then I will lose... If I lose these units, I will lose the band. So I gotta be very careful. You're right about that. Um... Kinda want the Vulnerary on Titania. So for the first turn here, I, I gotta send Titania down and just kick ass. You can only equip one hand axe at the time. Yeah, that's true. Or one ha one band at the time. Yeah, you can't have multiple. You can't stack them. No, you cannot. Alright, you get your wish, guys. I'm deploying Mia. <laughs> So, uh, Liana's over here. We gotta make sure we get her. So, uh, we're putting Ike and, Ike and Oscar together. Ah, shit. I normally let Bui tank this area. I guess we can't do that this time around. It's not like Mia can tank. I think what I need to do is I need to keep Titania here. Oscar here. And then maybe keep Ike here to, like, boost Oscar. And then maybe move Ike and Oscar away and move Titania in here later. Did you forget? I'm not gonna forge Mia sword. Shut up. <laughs> Fucking Mia fanboys. They're the worst. Absolute worst. Alright, it's an 8-turn defense chapter. Did you forge the hand? I don't have money to forge, guys. It's maniac mode. Um, but, if I remember... Yeah, there's some javelins here that we gotta be very careful about. So... Takes a little while for Titania, sadly, to, to kill all these guys. So who died? Oh, if only there was a death counter on screen, guys. Uh, can Oscar kill this mage turn one? He actually can. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hmm. I kind of want to kill this mage, not gonna lie. If I put Ike right here... Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. If I put Ike right here... He'll both be within range, and be within range of Oscar, which would be kind of cool. Boyd would be great here. Yeah, he would. He sure would. Yeah. It's a little scary to do this, because there's lots of guys that can attack Oscar. They all do pretty great against him, so... Not a big fan of this, but, uh... He can be attacked by, like, what? One guy here. And the archers ward him. That's such a fucking good idea. My goodness. Oh, my God. <laughs> ah, you're a genius. You see, sometimes chat gives good advice. You see, sometimes chat actually gives very good advice. So I guess we could we could let Soren kill this guy. Uh, just I'm looking for one shots here because Soren is so frail, but I think it's fine. Chat always gives good advice, not really, but but sometimes. I only give good advice. Train Makalo. 
I hear Makalo actually isn't terrible on Maniac mode, though. Because he's got very good growth rates in the... Like, it's just a little hassle to get him going. But, I mean, he still, he still becomes a Paladin, which is a really good class, so... So yeah, on main on on hard mode, Titania oh, like bulldozes these guys, but on maniac mode, I find that she barely has enough strength to like double them. And wow, what are these hit rates? My goodness. She also gets like slowly chip. As you can see, she really struggles killing these guys, and they're all gonna run back to the priests and get healed. So it's a bit annoying. Oh, very nice strength and defense. Very good, Titania. And one of these guys drops a red gem, which we really want to make sure we get. What mod was installed to display hit rates? Uh, it's from a streamer called Jellyfish Swimming. Swimmer Jellyfish. He made it himself. So, uh, it's a... It's a good mod. It's a very good mod. Okay, so the only problem now is that... Oscar kind of has to, like, tank this hallway by himself, unless we want to have freaking Mia in front, which is not smart. This is where Boyd would have been so useful. Oh, this is where Boyd would have been so freaking useful. Because Titania is not ready to go right yet. So we probably have to split Ike and Oscar up, which I really don't want to do. I'm also going to try and snipe a priest with Titania, because you really have to... Oh, what? What? I've never seen her go right before. What? What? I've never seen her do this. Oh, it's because I don't have any units over here. That's why. Huh. Well, well, well. That is unique. Yeah, she goes towards Ike, you're right. You are very right. Alright, Soren level up, let's go. Let's go! Let's go! Let's fucking go! It's a good Soren run. This is what it's all about. Okay, I really don't want to use my, uh... Whoa! No! God damn it! Now I have to use my... That's annoying. Good thing I, I saved, am I right? Don't worry, I'm gonna do it the same way, so that it's no taints. Um, I think that's how I did it, right? But I used the elixir, so... I, ha I, I will use... Oh, equip bands, right, sorry. Oh, I... No, I did equip it. I did equip it. It's okay, guys. I'm gonna do it the same way. I'm gonna do it the same way. Taint, you didn't have a vulnerary? Okay, well, I can do that for free next turn, so it's fine. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta pick up... No! Titania, what is up with these hit rates, woman? Ah... This is not okay. No, I'm not gonna check biorhythm. Noel donated 15 bucks. I'm putting out a hit on Makalov. $100? Your call? Oh, I'll kill Makalov for $100. Easy. <laughs> Easily. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's no problem at all. Yeah, yeah. Easiest $100 of my life. I'm gonna- I'm gonna hold you to that promise, Noel. You will need him? <laughs> I'll need the hundred dollars more. Okay, Titania's taking some damage. I guess Ike has to tank this hallway now. He has no choice. 61% chance to hit, it's pretty scary. And Ileana's going to the right? That's not good. Yeah, that is really not good. I don't like that one bit. Okay, 68. That's a nice dodge, though, Oscar. I actually appreciate that. 
All right, let's go. Strength, speed, defense. Let's go. Let's go. Is she? Please go left. Please go left, Ileana. Please go left. Please go left. Ileana, please. Please go left. Please. No, she's going right. Ah. That's actually terrible. Wait, Donla did a super champ? I don't see it, though. Ugh, good luck recruiting her. I just need I just need Titania to clean up in the bottom so she can go and clean up in the right. Because God knows that's the only way you can get anything done in this game. Um, I do actually kind of... I'm wondering if Titania may need to heal. That's the red gem guy. I, I guess I could... Uh, actually, there is one thing I can do. There's actually a really cool thing I can do. I can use the... Uh, are you serious? Another crash? Wow. You know what I think it is, guys? I think it's uh I think it's the rain. I think I think the rain is really messing up with Dolphin, because I never experienced so many crashes in a row. Oh, Donlot donated 5 euros to Super Chat. I made it to Ashnard Phase 2 while using Mia. If you can't do it while using her, you are weak sperm! You are weak sperm! I am Greek god. No, your mother fucked by goat. I am... You are the weak sperm. I am the strong sperm. Most sophisticated Balkan discussion. Uh, let's see. It's the steel... The steel axe is actually better here. Alright, so this is what I'm gonna do. Mia can shove wrists, I'm pretty sure. And that gives me the red gem too, which is really nice. There is one thing Mia is good for on this map, and that is to shove Riss around, like a little sissy. Ah, shit, I just put Mia behind Ike. That was actually not intentional. But I think I will just not attack here. I think I'll just... I do want to kill this guy, but I don't want to take damage, so I think I'll just... Ah, I use so many vulnerabilities, but at the same time, it's like I'm worried Ike is gonna die. Why no Regal Sword? Dude. Dude. Do you want Ike to die? Dude, that is, uh... With the Regal Sword, Ike dies. Because he's going to crit a bunch and get opened up by a lot of... He's going to get attacked by so many guys. He's got my Ike can easily one round those armor knights. Easily. If he gets a crit, then he'll face like three armor knights in a turn and he'll die and the Iron Man run is over. Dude, killing can be scary. Look at the damage he's taking. This is not good. He doesn't want to fight more than one enemy. Look at that. Look at that shit. You see how scary this is? Like, it's super scary. Again? Are you serious? Yeah, it's the rain. It's 100% the rain that's fucking with Dolphin. Like, I think it's definitely the rain. Maybe restart the emulator? Ah, I could try, but... I just make safe states every turn, so it's fine. It's not a big deal. Maybe you can stop speed. No! I will never stop speeding up. Ever. Alright, Oscar's doing a good job. He's tanking like a champ. Oh, the priests are running away. That's kind of funny. Okay, so I think what we'll do now is we'll change... Okay. If I put Oscar here and then Ike here, they are technically within range of each other. But that isn't doable right now, I think. I think maybe next turn there's a possibility we can do it that way. Here 
Here we go. Careful with the Polax fighter. Bruh, the po Oh, shit, the Polax fighter. Uh... Oh, shit. Oh, no. Uh, that's... You're very right. That is a problem. Uh... We got Cavaliers here, too, so we can't really do much. Uh... Well, then! Uh... <laughs> uh... Yeah, Mia's gonna die here. She is not gonna be able to. I mean... What can we do? What can we do? Not much. I'm thinking probably just Regal Sword here and trade back, maybe? They're definitely gonna go for Riss here. 6 speed, 9 speed. Oh, it's a longbow. That's off. Uh, unequip. Yeah, it's an unequip turn. This, this is an unequip turn. No Ileana. Uh, we need to get Titania over here. We need to smash our way through here. That is what we need to do. Oh, interesting. Ow. We need to get Titania over here ASAP. And we need to clear out the enemies. How many turns left do we have? We got three more turns. I think we're okay. So, I think what we're going to do is we're going to... Uh, Titania is okay. So, what we're going to do is we're going to use the Regal Sword to kill this guy. And then we're going to just... Rush in with, Ili with uh, Titania. Maybe even Steel Axe, maybe? Probably Steel Axe. And then, it would be cool if someone could get Ike out of there. I don't think that's possible right now, though. And as for Soren, I mean, I could bring this guy down to one health. Is there anyone else who can attack Soren here? I don't think so, actually. I think I'll just vulnerary probably. How much does the Polax do to Oscars? That's 29 damage. Which is very scary, but the other guys won't really do that much to him. So I think per perhaps... Um... Uh, Archer's gonna run and heal. That is probably right. So we kill him. Yeah, we kill him. Again? Really? Wow. These crashes, man, are incredible. There we go, and then we will heal Ike up. We'll do everything the same way, don't you worry. Meng's manipulating RNG. Ah, PH is calling me out. He's calling me out. Meng, I did some quick searches, and it looks like Super Chats are safe. It's a purchase you make with Google. They take a cut of the money and send the rest to the creator, huh? Oh, oh, it was Donlot, right. I, super chat YouTube are a little bit greedy, but I mean what else is new YouTube is YouTube. I mean this is how they work Stop posting the emulator and, and, and pretend it crashed <laughs> Yeah, that's exactly what I'm doing That's exactly what I'm doing Actually, you Norse people eat dolphins and whales, so it is getting back at you. I don't. We don't eat dolphins. Whales, we do eat. It's legal to eat in Norway. I think it's like the only country in the world that's actually legal to eat dolphins. So that's kind of funny. Fuck dolphins. That's all I'm gonna say. All right. Let's see how scary the. Uh, let's see how scary the Polax fighter is for Oscar, shall we? All right. It's another level up for Soren, and I'm getting a great level up. Oh, let's go! Magic skill luck resistance. This is the go. 
Uh, it's not that scary. As long as he's on full health, it's fine. All right, we got to start clearing shit out here. Twitch makes way more than YouTube. I've heard conflicting reports about that, but maybe you're right. Do not fuck the dolphin. No, please do not. Do not. Wow, I got defense on Riz. I got defense on Riz. Crazy. Okay, we got some soldiers. I can probably handle those, I'd say. Just regular iron lances, it's fine. Oh no. We're not listening to the meat song. I don't want to listen to the Psalm Ooga Booga music. I, uh, I, I'm kind of tired of it. It's like, no, no. I, 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 I started going a little bit crazy listening to it. Uh, put high up papaya. That was the song that played in no fucking way. Oh, I got defense. Ooh, let's go. Eliana might I don't think she attacks. I don't think I don't think Eliana attacks you at all. She just moves towards Ike, so. Okay, I think we have a chance to recruit her. I think it's possible at this point. We just have to clear a path. Hey, maybe a kill for Mia, who knows? Okay, what turn are we on right now? We are on... Oh my god, we got two turns left to do it, guys. <laughs> we got two turns left to do this shit. Uh, we have to kill more healers, I think. Otherwise, we're never gonna get through here. There we go. Uh, we might be able to get through next turn, maybe. Uh, we actually, ironically, have to put Mia in front here, which is really dumb, uh, but it's kind of what we have to do. Otherwise, yeah, we need Ike over here. Oh my goodness. I think we have to unequip Mia and put her here, funnily enough. Um, we, we actually have to. <laughs> we actually have to. You know what? Let's give her a Slim Sword. Why not? She's not going to kill them, so... Trade the hand axe? What are you talking about? She has a hand axe already. Alright, uh, and let's kill this guy as well. This guy has a pole axe, but it's not that scary, so I think it's fine. One times two, classic me. Oh, that's right, this guy drops a pure water. I forgot about that, actually. That's kind of cool. Alright, so I'm just hoping I'll be able to clear a path towards Ileana this turn. It kind of depends on whether the armor knights attack me or not, I guess. I think I might be able to do it, maybe? It depends. There's so many calves around, though. Uh, Please kill. There you go. 99% chance to hit. That's very good. Come on, kill this guy, too. Oh, my goodness. Kanto away, please. Kanto away. Kanto away, thank you. Okay, good, they're attacking me. Do I kill, though? I do. That's good. Ah, this is gonna be tricky. I don't know if I'm gonna get her, guys. Please kill her, too. Okay, very good. Uh, so we got Myrmidons in the way. That's not great. I don't know if I'll get her. This is not looking good, guys. Maybe if that last... Okay, nice. She's she's doubling. That's good. Uh, she's not doubling the Myrmidon, sadly. Oh, there is a chance. There is a chance, actually. Oof. 
there is I think I think we can get it. I think we can get her. No! The soldier! No, oh, wait, 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 wait. No, Ileana, did you just do what I think you did? Uh is it possible at this point? I don't think so. What if we shove Soren twice? Can Soren kill the Myrmidon? Maybe. I think if we shove Soren twice, can Mia? Okay, we'll shove Soren. Uh, I am kind of risking this though because there's a fucking. I think what I'll do is I'll just pick up Riss and run. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I'll literally just run. Um. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. He'll, he'll need to be shoved twice. But what I can do is I can attack. Nah, it's not possible. Wait a minute. Does does Ileana recruit herself? She doesn't. Kill soldier with Ike doesn't actually never mind. I think she does, doesn't she? Ike will be in big danger and I don't know if he will, because we can get Oscar over here. One, two, three. She doesn't? Are you sure? Can someone... Can you stop guessing and actually just... So, here's the thing. I can shove Soren twice to get him here, but... That leaves me wide open here. <laughs> so, that's that's the problem. Um, I do have Oscar, though. The thing is, Oscar will die. Yeah, I don't think it's worth it. It's a shame. I really wanted Ileana. But, uh... That's, that's an Iron Man for you. Oh, that's a good point. Uh, yeah, that's actually a very good point. Titania can kill a unit on Kanto. The problem is that it leaves Ike very, very vulnerable on... Like, the, look at all the Cavaliers here. There's a chance he dies. That's, that's the problem. Uh, let's see what his biorhythm is. It's normal. So, uh... Yeah, I just checked by rhythm. That's how desperate I got. So, I don't think this is possible. I think we'll just kind of accept that Ileana is dead. Yeah. Yeah, I think we just, um... I think we just keep her here. No Ileana for us, guys. That's just how it is. Not much we can do about that right now. I think let's just focus on... Let's focus on getting as much experience as we can out of these guys. Let's put Oscar in front, probably. The boss might attack, which is not great. Um... We'll put Ike here. Oscar here. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we put we put Ike here, Oscar here. At least we have Mia. That's true. You do. Oh, okay. Riss is fine. He's on full health. We'll have to mend up Oscar like so, and then we'll put Ike. Honestly, it's probably better to put Ike here. I think I'll put him here. He's in range. That's how we're gonna do it. It's the best way to do it. Not not ideal, but oh well. A little bit sad. I really wanted to. Um, I really wanted to use her actually, but that's just the way it is sometimes, you know. I 
A Boyd is actually pretty important in this chapter. You need his DPS. And uh, not having him. Mia is just too frail to do anything on this chapter. She just stands there and guards the entrance like an idiot. I could have unfielded her for the bonus experience. Oh, no. Well, she did something, I guess. She guarded. She saw some combat, you guys. Just crash the emulator and safe state. That's a great idea. This run really makes me want to do a third Maniac Mode run. Well, it's good to see we got some mentally ill people in chat. Always nice to see. She's right there. If we just had one more turn. If we just had one more turn, you guys. I've never seen her go right before. That's... Well, at least Oscar is leveling up like an actual Giga Chad. So that's very good to see. My goodness. What a great level up. Hi, Mordecai. Do not fight. <laughs> you get bonus experience for every character you do not field here, which is kind of funny. All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's check the battle report. We're going to make sure we don't skip the battle report. MVP Titania, bonus experience 25, no new allies. And I, I guess we got to put Ilion on the death counter then. Kind of sad, but that's how it goes. All right, ladies and gentlemen. All right, ladies and gentlemen. I think that's enough for one night. Let's do a final meme review. Let us make a safe state. But first, let's go through our units and see how they're performing so far. Ike, one of the best Ikes I've ever seen. 14 strength, 15 speed. This is if, unless he just suddenly decides to stop leveling strength and speed, this is a very good thing. This is a very good thing. Uh, if we can get him to cap strength and speed in the late game, that is going, his defenses are low though. That is a problem. So maybe we'll give him the night ban for a little bit. Uh, Titania Ash is always good. Is there ever a run where Titania is not good? Soren is amazing too. 11 magic, 12 speed. This is fantastic. I would actually not mind him leveling strength a couple times so that he lo he gets even more reduction to the weight of the fire tome. So maybe I'll give him like a fighter ban just for that. I don't know. Oscar, also another really solid unit. Strength 10, 14 speed, 13 defense. This is Oscar at his finest. He doubles and he's tanky. Uh, Riz, he heals. I'm going to bench him once Mist shows up. Bad unit. Yeah. We lost Ileana and Boyd. Kinda sad, but uh, that's how things go. Alright. Wow, that's a lot of memes. My goodness. That's a lot of memes. <laughs> yeah. That's kind of how it feels. That's kind of how it feels. Getting all the other memes. Mm, oh. My goodness, you guys are sending in a lot of memes. Oh, let's see. There we go. Three, three, three more memes. All right, there we go. I think I got all of them. All right, let's go. Mom, 
Who is your favorite? Sweetie, I love both equally. I shall reset for you. It's the, I did reset for Oscar and not Boyd. This is true. <laughs> okay, that's good. Oh, that's good. God, that Sonichu medallion looks so fucking rancid. Look at that thing. Oh my god, it looks disgusting. Oh, look at it. Look at that thing. Look at that medallion. Oh my goodness. Ah. Oh. Reset for boy to train me. Uh, chat every Iron Man. Yeah. Sultangs? I hate that picture of me. It's so old. I killed your dog, so now that I'm the only bitch in your life. Ah, uh, guys, don't date girls like this. What's this? Rate my waifu. Uh, cat ears, 0 out of 10. Let's see. What's this? Oh, are these all the bond support? Allendite. Really? Oh, Ragno n negates crits? I actually didn't know that. I actually didn't know that. So, Elinsha. Okay, so Ike protects Soren. Grail protects Titania. Elinsha protects Ike, Bastion, Joffrey, Lucia, and Kier. With Kieran? She protects Kieran? I guess he is a Knight of Crimea. Tanith protects Marcha. Ashnard protects Patrine? Really? Tibarn protects Olki. Tibarn protects Janath. Nesala protects Neoluchi. Joffrey protects Kieran. Joffrey protects Kieran? I did not know that. Wow. That's crazy. I actually had no idea. Chat waiting for Mia to appear so they can comment about- Oh yeah, that's- that's chat alright. Mia fans, Mia, Mia, Mia. Unspoken risk sexual harassment. Uh, oh, you need help. Oh my god, you need help, chat. Oh, chat, stop it, stop it. Oh, stop it. Dane soldiers, lay down your weapon. You are surrounded. All I am surrounded by, uh, by is fear and dead men. Mangs, why is the stream crashing so much? Meanwhile... <laughs> Black Knight, I would prefer to use your proper weapon so that I might see you at your full strength. Grail, the only weapon I need right here. Grail, five seconds later. You shall not... Okay, so... Here's a hot take. I hate the little thing they did in Radiant. Do you, do you guys know in Radiant Dawn they kind of retconned and said that the reason Grail lost was because he slashed the tendons in his arm? I fucking hate that. I hate that so much. I think it's actually much cooler to that Grail is actually at his full strength, but the Black Knight is just that strong that he just murders him. I think I think it devalues. Wait, they actually say that in Path of Radiance? It, they do? Oh, they say that in this game. Okay, so it's not a retcon. Okay, never mind. I still hate it, though. I, I think it devalues the Black Knight as a villain. I think it's much cooler to imagine that Grail... Maybe had just gotten a little older, but he's still very strong. I hate this notion that he was, like, weakening himself. I, I don't like it. I think it's a, I think it's a bad story decision.
I don't get this one. What? Oh, <laughs> okay, that's kind of funny. Yeah, that's true. That's funny. No one sniper wolf 12.5 seconds nanoseconds after YouTube demonetized her. Yeah, if they ever do, she'll make an apology video. I don't know if she has. I don't pay attention. Trolley problem. Nobody's any danger. You do you jump in front of the moving trolley? <laughs> That's. <laughs> Should have put Boyd there. That would have been very dark. All right. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Q and A time. Did I miss any donation? I don't think so. Nope. That's good. Ooh. <sighs> Mang, so are there any plans for something special for Patreon CMU picks? Um, no. I mean, we're gonna keep picking you. We've unlocked all the child units, so there's gonna be a lot of new characters. Sev, are there any... Uh, Midnight asks, Hey, Mangs, uh, if you were f to live in Andaron, which house would you serve? Oh. Huh, which house would I serve? That's a good question. Uh, probably house... I mean, house Rose got lots of pretty blonde girls, so I guess that's, uh... I mean, I guess I'm... I, I, I suppose my fiancé is not coming with me, so... You know, if she's coming with me, then I guess we'll go serve house... Sp spare Garden or something, I don't know. Bethany would probably want to serve, like, Fred's house, so... Spare Garden or, or Rose sounds like a good fit. Uh, Gregor MCN asks, next Path of Radiance Iron Man stream is going to be next Friday, a week from now. Untendo asks, do you think F engaged writing is worse than Fates or Shadow Dragon? It's definitely worse than Fates. Uh, Shadow Dragon, I actually kind of like the writing of Shadow Dragon. It's very simplistic, but it works. So, uh, I, yeah, definitely. Al Baker asks, I have a rather interesting des design decision in my hack. I use Talia's movement ranges, except that flyers have one less move range than cavalry. What are your thoughts on this? I can see I can see flyers moving slower than cavalry. Because horses do gallop pretty fast, except that they're slowed down by terrain. I think that's cool. That's a cool design decision. Depends on how much movement you're giving your calves in the first place, though. Are you giving them like nine? Manx, would you consider doing a Mega Iron Man? Yes, I do want to do an Iron Man where I like, where I, where I do, where I Iron Man all the games in sequence. That would be pretty funny. Violin asks, Violin of the Coyotes Men? Yes, he is indeed Violin of the Coyotes Men. Falso, what was ruined because it became too popular? Fire Emblem. Uh, Her would ask, would Engage be better if Diamant was the protagonist? Oh, 100%. You can still have a Leer. A Lyric could play the role as kind of like Tiki. You know, a character that joins like halfway through the plot, but is still very important. You can still have a Lear. I think that would actually make a Lear better too. Uh, but yeah, Diamant should have 100% be the protagonist of Engage. That would have been so much better. Striker asks, would you rename Grim Leal to Shaw Me Wami? <laughs> no. I, I could. Daniel Gomez asks, do you agree with the statement that the problem in Engage isn't the plot, but rather the writing? Uh, the plot works. I mean, the plot is fine. It's just gather MacGuffins. Fire Emblem has done that plenty of times. The problem with Engage is a lack of world building and just a lack of trying. It, like, dialogue is just bare bones, and it's just terrible writing. There's really no other ways to put it, really. Um, Nintendo asks, who is the worst unit on Maniac Mode? Uh, probably, like, one of the late game joining units, like Olki or... Probably Lucia. Lucia really can't do anything. She's really is just filler. Um, so probably something like that. Ufas, which Fire Emblem do you think is ha aged the best? Fates? Definitely Fates. Fates aged incredibly well. It's still fun to play to this day. Uh, Bethany asks, should Alicia fans be shot on sight? Alicia fans from Andran Saga? Or is there some other Alicia you're talking about? Uh, Pedro uh, Sorup says, If you could add any Radiant Dawn unit to Path of Radiance, who would it be and how would you implement them? Hmm. I would really enjoy having another unit in the early game for the Grail Mercenaries. I mean, I'd say Soth, but he's not really a Radiant Dawn unit. Hmm. What unit would fit well into... Um what unit would fit well into Path of Radiance's cast that's exclusive to, uh... Aaron, maybe? Aaron for the Dawn Brigade? Like, a soldier for the Dawn Brigade? So we have 
We have Boyd who's an axe wielder. Rolf who's an archer. Rissus a healer. Like, what do we need? I guess, like, uh, I guess, like, the, do the, the, the Rails mercenaries do pretty much have every weapon type covered, so. One thing that is, like, Oliver. <laughs> Oliver would be a cool pick, yeah. I would have enjoyed an early game thief, to be honest. Maybe Heather. That'd be kind of cool to have Heather in the early game as a thief. Yeah, like a young Heather. That'd be cool. How old is she in Radiant Dawn? I think she's like 25, right? So she'd, she'd be like Titania's age in Path of Radiance, but that's that's A-OK -okay with me. I don't know. Like, I, I would enjoy having a thief in the early game so I could run around and steal Vulnerize. I think that would have been very cool. Manx, how awesome is Altina? Altina has really cool design. I will admit that. Uh, Altina, Altina has a really kick-ass design. San Daniel Gomez says, which unit in FA9 has the best unit feel? Uh, I would say pr it can be Oscar, depending on... I, I, whatever unit gets blessed, I'd say. Uh, but I will say that... Nefani is fun to use, especially on hard mode. She's very fun to use because of Wrath. So... Nintendo asks, who would you consider the worst Jagan? A Vander. Either Vander or Gunther. Uh, because they just fall off so incredibly quickly. At least in Conquest, Gunther can do something, but in Revelation, he's so bad. But Vander is such a shame, because Vander is like... His internal level is so high that he doesn't level up. So he's kind of just stuck at his base level. And the enemies outpace him, like, already by Chapter 3 or 4. Enemies are doubling and killing him, and it's such a waste. I don't understand why they couldn't just give Vander normal experience gains. Because his growth rates aren't shit. But it's really sad. Uh, yeah, Rep Gunter actually does have some utility. You're right about that, If You can reclass him to Vyvern, for example. Uh, but yeah, Vander really is shit. <laughs> he is such a bad unit. Uh, Pospi asks, Would you say offense or defense is more valuable than Fire Emblem? In every other Fire Emblem game, offense is the best. In Path of Radiance Maniac mode, you gotta have defense. That's how they, that's how it works. Striker asks, would you one day do an Andron Saga CMU? Only if someone rebuilds the ROM, because we don't have ROM space. Medic asks, how about it in the FE4 remake, they add a new class that would work like an APC? Ah, I get anxious every time I think about all the things that they, they might do to FE4, if I'm gonna be completely honest. They're, they're totally going to replace uh, Oifi with a tactician, and I really am not ready for that. And Sophia asks, Same things, can you play Metro Dread for Halloween? It'd be funny to see you try the sexy half-bird woman game. Um, I'm definitely, like, looking for games to play for Halloween, so definitely mail me your suggestions to mengsmemes at gmail.com. Maybe mail me, like, a trailer of the game. I'll, I'll definitely see if I can play a game for Halloween. I should do that. Paper Assassin asks, how much to kill off Sword of Jartain? Yeah, I'm not killing off those two. No, 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 no. I want to I wanna beat this run. Like, like, no. They are they are not on the hit list. Makalov, sure. Sword and Titania, no, no. Healthy asks, Manx, is there a 100% secret patch for Andron Saga? The one on Discord doesn't work. I don't know. Uh, someone, I, I'm guessing it's because we released a new version of the game. So probably someone just has to update the patch. Um... Oof, ask play Gaiden without speed up for Halloween. That would definitely be dreadful, I agree with that. You might- there's a good chance you might see me kill myself on stream, so yeah, that would be pretty horrible. So, uh, yeah, a very good suggestion of... Bethany asks, worst girl in each Fire Emblem? That's a very comprehensive question, sweetie. Um, but I can, like, I can list, like, three very bad girls. Um... Worst girl. Uh, I really don't like Yunaka. I'm sorry, guys. She's annoying as fuck. Uh, her design is kind of cute, except for the uh, except for the little things in her hair. But I really cannot stand her personality. I'm really sorry. She she grates me. Um, Perry, obviously. Perry, like I I even forgot about her. That's how horrible she is. And probably Hortensia. I really don't like Hortensia. She gets so much screen time. It's ridiculous how much screen time she gets. She's not even a main character. And she's like, get, gets more screen time than the main lords. It's so dumb. And she's a clown. So. Hilda from FE4. Hilda's a good antagonist, though. That's the thing. Like, she's a horrible woman, but she's a great antagonist. You really want to kill her. 
Uh, Radiant Invals, what's your opinion on Soren now as a character since you used to immensely hate him? I didn't like him before, but I've definitely gained an appreciation for Soren. I like him now, I really do. Um. Alright, a couple more questions, then I'm logging off. Ufas, Hilda did nothing wrong and Talti enjoyed it. That's not a question of. Oh, you didn't put QA, so that's not that's on me. Nintendo asks, will you consider using Nephany? I am considering it. She is a bit of a meme, though, if I'm gonna be completely honest. She doesn't. The only way to make Nephany viable is to support her with Braum. And even then, she's not very good. She usually just follows him around like a backpack. Um, I don't know. I tried using Nephany last time, and I wasn't supremely impressed with her. It was just kind of, yeah, she was kind of just there, you know? She was okay, but I think I'd rather give that spot to someone else. L. Baker asks, could I email you a description of my hack so far for critique? Sure, but I can't promise you that I have time to critique it, honestly. Because I'm very busy. Daniel Gomez asks, chat mod tier list. That would be fun to make, but uh, all my female mods would just start bitching. So, um... You know, because they got such great personalities, all of them. They're all S tier, so, you know. Uh, Kristen asks, what class would suit you if you were a Fire Emblem character? I think, like, general or, like, warrior, or, like, something axe-wielding or something. Like, I think I would wear armor because the bigger you are, the more sense it makes for you to wear armor. Because when you're big, you're not as quick. Uh, and you're a bigger target. But you're also strong, and you can carry heavy stuff, so... The bigger you are, the more real the more you should wear plate armor. So I kinda like the the mountain, like the game mountain from Game of Thrones, like his kind of fighting style where you're just you're very big, you have massive armor and a very long sword, and you kinda use reach to kinda fuck people over. One thing that I absolutely hate in, in modern media, and this is like one thing that like I'm not like a I don't I'm not like a combat specialist or anything. I don't like do sword fighting. Uh, but I am very interested in it, and I have I have done like a little bit of like sword play, like what do you call it, live action role play, where you run around and hit hit, hit each other. But I, I'm no by no means like an expert or anything. But I will say that one thing that grates me beyond belief is the depiction of like a tall guy in with like a great sword, and then like you see a, like a like a David versus Goliath style fight. Where a tall guy with a great sword fights against a small person with a sword. In 99% of all cases, the tall guy with the great sword murders the small guy. Because he will just use his reach to just bully the little guy. There ain't no... You're not gonna, like, dart past his range. That's not how combat works. If you've ever done real combat, like, if someone has a weapon with a lot of reach, you're not getting close to them. You're not getting close to them. And this is like, I hate it when modern media depicts these like fights where you have a guy with like a spear and the small guy just goes, oh, and like goes into close combat. It's like, no, that's not going to happen. You're just going to get poked. So I wish that would like be displayed a bit more in modern media. Just go around and hit him from behind. Yeah. Too many video games have fucked this up. Like that and how useless armor is in movies. Like, people who, like, cut through plate mail like it's made of paper. Do you guys know how difficult it is to penetrate full plate armor? Like, you can stab that thing with a sword, and you're just gonna- it's just gonna bounce off. Like, it's really tough. I really wish modern movies would show the effectiveness of armor and how difficult it is to, like, fight against an opponent with reach. I would love for that to actually be the case again. Uh, I would love a movie that, like... If you guys have any recommendations of actual movies that takes this seriously, I'd love to watch them. Bethany asked, do you not like Thorfinn versus Torkoal? It's a great fight. It's spectacular to behold. But in any normal setting, Torkoal would just murder Thorfinn. And let's be real, Torkoal does win both of their fights. So, well, Thorfinn kind of wins the second one with a bit of cheating from Askeladd. But in both of the cases, Torkoal does kick Thorfinn's ass, which is very realistic. So I kind of like that. But yeah, it's a, a Thorfinn in season one of Vinland Saga. He's kind of cringe. Like it's Naruto running and stuff. I really don't like it. But hey, it's an anime. What do you what, what do you expect? Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I'm out. I'll see you guys on Sunday with some more Awakening. I'll see you on Friday with some more Fire Emblem. I might do a stream on Tuesday. I haven't quite decided yet. See you guys. Have fun. Take care. Good night. Bye bye. <laughs>